Hey, hey, guess who? Okay, there we go. I thought my mouth was just stuck like that. Hold on, hold on. Let me let me pick, fix my positioning. Oh god, oh god. Okay, there we go. Maybe I don't know. Okay, Mike up. Uh, Mike. Uh, okay, there we go. Sweet. I think I should be good now. All right. Let me make sure. Let me make sure. Oh, perfect. Perfect. All right. Hey, hey, Sideres. Welcome to yet another street. Why is my? Hold on. Let me reset position on my avatar. Let me do that. Okay. That should be. Oh, that's already a lot better. All right. Okay, just checking the track in. Okay. Well, usually the mouth movement's better than that, but oh well. Oh well. What? No, that. What is going on with my mouth? That's a sentence I didn't think I'd say today. <laughs> Sorry, I'm mature. I'm mature. I swear. I swear. Okay. Testing. Looking at my movement. Ah, uh, it's good. It's good enough. As long as you can tell I'm talking. I'll get a better model eventually. It still does the trick, though. No, why is it? Hold on. That is kind of bizarre. Usually it tracks my mouth movement a lot better. Um. Okay. Let's see if it does it now. Okay. Yeah, screw it. Good enough. It's only doing the A, I, O. It's only doing the A. Uh. Why are you only doing A? Uh? Okay. Oh well. That should be fine. That should be fine still. As long as you all can hear me. I guess that's the important thing in the end. My mouth's not even open that much. Okay. Weird stuff with my avatar aside. Hello everyone. And welcome to yet another Breath of the Wild stream. I say we're back. We finally got off the cliff. Link's greatest enemy, a plateau. We finally got past it here. So, now we can explore the rest of Hyrule. Let's go! But yeah, we're gonna be going to Impa first. Uh, that's what the king told us last time. Was to go see Impa in the village. And we're about to do that. We're right over by the Dueling Peaks, so. And plus, we're just gonna do some exploring in general anyway. Like, I want to do plenty and plenty and explore and see what cool things we can find today. We do have the new side quest now, so. Like, we've got the stuff for a game, for, for stuff from the past games. Hold on, let me go ahead and get Elgato ready. Okay, perfect, perfect. I know this music's a bop, but we're probably going to have to go ahead and say goodbye to it for a little bit all right I'll let we'll let this one run its course all right it's run its course <laughs> okay now we can go ahead and get started with some breath of the wild uh it's almost 20 minutes into this stream and I, oh god oh it's all auto saves okay cool cool yeah let's continue dueling peak towers Holy shit, that's loud. I am going to go ahead and turn this down just a tiny bit here. Just a tiny bit. Hopefully you can still hear it. Oh wait, yeah, I got the shrine thing. I should probably go look for shrines. Right, I probably should do that. But I could also go, oh.
there's also like I saw a stable on the way here. Um, I'm not sure where it's at. What's it? I know that's a shrine over there. I definitely see it. Oh, there's the. Oh, if I can remember ever how if I can ever remember how to play this game, there it is. There's a a stable. Oh, uh oh. I think there's a stable on the other side of the Dueling Peaks. I believe, I hope. Oh, I really hope I'm right. Oh, I remember this. I remember, I know where this uh, shrine is. In a uh, very awkward place, if I remember. Like, it's somewhere up in the cliffs. Oh, well, there, there it is. I'll be damned, what do you know? <laughs> We found it. I. That was easy. I really was not expecting it to be that easy. Oh god. Okay, let's just get over to the side. Stop beeping at me. I see it. You're lucky I have you on still. I only need I only need you on just to get to this. Even though I really don't actually. I. Uh, see it with my own two eyes where this shrine is now. Oh, that was close. The Ridahi shrine. Nice. Okay, very nice. Well, time to put my switch in. For the Ridahi shrine. Alright, let's see what this shrine's all about. I don't remember what this one is. I only remember a very few shrines. And what they do. But this one is not one of them. I'll tell you what, that is for sure. I haven't uh, the slightest clue of what this shrine is. I'm scared every time though. Because I'm worried that it's going to be this, the shrine. Okay, it's not the shrine. Good. You, to you, said Sweden Shrine, I am Rita He. In the name of the goddess Halia, I offer this trial. Okay. Oh. Okay. I don't think. Yeah, there's no chest up there, I see. Even then, there's like a little thing I can get up to. Okay, nice. Okay. Look at that skill! I do remember this. I do exact, in fact, remember this. I think there's a hidden tra- uh oh. There's like a hidden chest somewhere, isn't there? Yeah, should be. I don't know, we're about to find out. We're about to fuck around and find out. Don't worry, Link, you're fine. It's all good. Yep, there it is. Oh, I'm a dangerous person. Ah, oh, dang. I'm not as good as I thought. Oh, heck yeah, I'm good. I'm as good as I thought. No! Bastards! Rita, he, how could you? Oh, how much hearts did I lose? Do I need to heal? Oh, I need to heal. Oh, why'd you start me so close to that edge? Oh, ooh, no, 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 no. Oh, dear God, no. Why would you do that? Okay, it's fine, it's fine. Look, see, we're gonna have, I don't wanna, we have an apple. I should heal more. 
Uh, what's something good? Oh, some honey. Perfect. Okay. Aha! Got it! That's how it's done, baby! Let's go! Climber's bandana. Ooh. Actually, it's kind of nice to have. It may look like a regular bandana, but it's actually infused with ancient technology that enhances core strength to improve your climbing ability. Which means more stamina. Okay, there's nothing down here. I just want to make sure. Alright, Reed Dahi with your fancy hat. I don't think the others had a fancy hat, did they? I can't remember. Your resourcefulness in overcoming this trial speaks to the promise of a hero. I'm going to do a regular voice for now. In the name of the goddess Hylia, I bestow upon you this spirit orb. Ooh, okay. Wow. You had the chance to have it go through the hoop. And it didn't go through the hoop. That's, uh... Kind of disappointing. Just a little, you know, just a little. I was made a goddess smile. I'm not smiling. It is, in fact, the exact opposite. Like, I'm just. Really, you had a hoop, though. You had a fucking hoop. You could have made that spirit orb thing look cool. But no, you're just like, okay, I'm gonna do it like the, everyone else. I said, you already had the, the, the rings, you had the hat. You, sh you might, have, might as well have gone the extra step just to be more extra. Ain't nothing wrong with being a little extra. Oh, another shrine. Oh, this is the one I was thinking about. Unless... Oh, there's the cobbler. That's something over there for sure. There should be like an opening or somewhere over here. Oh, I don't have it in me to... Uh... <gasps> okay, bull... No, 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 no. No, no, Link, you fucking moron! I don't have bow anyway. Alright, come at me, you fucking shits. Haha! <laughs> Ow! That kinda hurt. Soldier's broadsword. Okay, what do I drop? What do I need to drop just to get that? Oh, drop the rusty broadsword. No, don't equip it. Drop it. No, drop it. I don't want the Boku Bat. I don't want the Spike. Oh, I actually do kind of want the Spike Boku Shield. That's a lot better than the regular, so. Drop it. Oh, I have a fun idea. Oh. What if I just, uh... I wanna... You know, what colors act? What if I just do this? Fine. Okay, there we go. The head... That could've been cool. But it wasn't. That's fine. Who needs to be cool anyway? Right? Who needs it? I don't. I totally don't. Okay, I'm gonna turn that off. Shrine! Shut up! I know it's important to find shrines and all that so I can get spirit orbs. But I don't need it right now. I got a boomerang. Ooh. I forgot you could use boomerangs in this game. Heck yeah, that's nifty. 
Oh. Okay, nope, hold on. Magne magnetism. There's definitely gotta be like a chest in here, right? No? Okay. That's fine. I didn't want there to be a chest anyway. I did find that stable though. I was right. Oh, there's the other shrine. Well, perfect. Ah. There's spikes. They heard you go up. Oh, yep, yep. Oh. Okay. <laughs> wow. Who would have thought? Spikes hurt. Who would have guessed? Oh, Beetle. Yeah. Hey, I don't believe I've made your acquaintance. I, the name's Beetle, but you can call me. Actually, let's just stick with Beetle. But even if you forget my face, you can remember me by my Beetle-shaped backpack. Wow. Despite these dangerous times, You'll find me traveling all over Hyrule to fulfill your shopping needs. I stock many special bugs and must-have items for travelers, and I always charge a fair price. Or my name's not Beetle. <laughs> I always I also buy all sorts of things. If you're in need of rupees, gemstones in particular fetch a high price. Look what I've got. I do indeed have some gemstones. A ruby. Okay, let's sell it. All of them for 210 rupees. Ooh. Um, I don't think there's anything else for me to sell. Oh, yeah, the opals. Wow! 240. Nice. Let me buy something nice. What have you got, Beetle? Oh, yes, arrows. I do need arrows. 120 rupees. Yeah. Oh. Take them all. Wow. 60. Wow. Now I got plenty of rupees. Plenty. And you know what? You might as well buy uh, all of Beetle's yeah. stock, in my opinion. In my opinion, help the man stay in business. Oh. I'm trying to move down and buy everything else, Beetle. Wow. <laughs> okay, Octo Balloon. Yeah. 60. Wow. There we go. Thanks for your for the visits. Did you need anything else? No. Yay. Yeah, okay. Goodbye. <laughs> Goodbye. Get me out of here, please. Oi. I give you directions. Hi. Welcome to Dooley Peak Stable. What do you think of this place? Pretty nice, eh? It might be hard to imagine now, but this place was nearly destroyed about 100 years ago. However, thanks to the blessing of the Dooley Peaks, everything in full is full of life again. Even the wild horses are back. There's a lot of energy in this place. So where are you heading? Both Kakariko Village and ha Hanado Village are nearby. Ah, Kakariko. Oh. Kakariko Village is where the Sheikah clan lives. Mm. It's said that some time ago, they had advanced techniques that were... More powerful than anyone had ever seen. But that power put them at odds with the king at the time, and they were scattered across the land. Anyway, if you leave here and follow the road straight to the north, you'll find a big big bridge. Cross that and keep following the path, and you'll come to Kakariko Village Gate. Leave it to Ren Renza to tell you about the roads around this area. Goodbye. <sighs> okay. Oh, for a nice a lot of monsters come out at night, so be careful when the sun sets. Oh, I, I realize that. Hi. Good my stable. We deal with all things horse related. We are we also double as an inn. I haven't seen your face before. You know about the stable system? I do, but just for the sake of uh. everyone watching at home. They'll allow me to explain. You can board uh, your horse companions with us and then summon them as you please from our network of stables. You may have come across wild horses during your travels, not yet. Catch one and ride it here to register. It will be, become your horse companion. One person can board up to five horses, and you're able to swap horses in and out as you please. Do you know how to catch wild horses? Nah. Oh. Okay, to catch wild horse, all you have to do is approach it from behind slowly so it doesn't notice you, and then hop on. These are wild animals we're talking about, so if the horse you're riding starts to act up, try soothing it. 
It will eventually settle down, and when that happens, bring it to me. It may take a while for riding horses to get used to being ridden. They may change direction or slow down on their own until you earn their trust and respect. If your horse disobeys your directions, you want to gently redirect it and then calm it. And if you continue interacting that way, your horse will naturally begin to trust you and become more obedient. Oh. That's all I can tell you about the subject, stranger. Hey. Okay. Yeah, buddy. Ah. Oh. That might be just that one, but I thought it was like a... Oh. I... Wait, hold on. There's a... Let me check the map. We're at... There's the Dueling Peak Stable. Did one of our side missions have to do with the Dueling Peak Stable? I don't think so, but I, I should probably check out. The Highland Stable, the Riverside Stable, they have Village Ruins. Woodland Stable, South Oxwest Stable, Outpost Ruins. Okay, no. Dueling Peak Stable did not have anything. Now, let's see if we can find some uh, wild horses around here. Oh, well, what do you know? Okay, crouch, you damn fool. Crouch. Okay. Just having a horse would be actually very nifty to have. Just sneak. Just sneak. I want that blue one. Uh oh. Orange boy's looking. You're kidding me. Best be joking. Okay. Holy crap. Okay. Yep. Hmm. Okay. Turn around. Turn around. I just have to risk it for the biscuit. I don't remember how to do this, but we're about to find out. Oh crap, that takes stamina. Okay, is there anything I can do to uh, boost my stamina? Just for a little bit. No, okay. But I guess I'm not boosting my stamina. Okay, horsey, you're coming with me. Maybe. Let's see. following it keep following okay you can stop now horse you can stop you can stop 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 please oh thank you thank you so much if this don't work I'm gonna have to go cook some stamina stuff Oh, nice. Okay, this one didn't take as much. Okay. Okay, there we go. We gotta. Hey! I could give you directions. I don't care about directions right now. Welcome to our stable. If you come with our horse, you can register it here. Uh, let's register a horse. Gotcha. You sure you want this one? I mean, yeah, it's good. This is a good start. 
We charge registration fees to help support our conservation efforts. The fee will also get you a locally made saddle and bridle for your horse. The fee is 20 rupees. Is that okay? Yeah. Thanks. Okay. 20 rupees. That's not that bad. Please name your horse. Oh, chat. What do I name the horse? What do I name the horse? That is a good question. That is a very good question. Um. Um. Hmm. Okay, you know, I'm going to go ahead and name this horse. Mouse. <laughs> oh. This is a great name for a horse. You're right, so you complete. Would you like to take your new horse with you? Yeah, take the horse. Oh, oh by the way, if you get somebody from your horse, you can whistle and it will come running. Yep, that's what the whistle function's for. Your horse has a magic. Can't hear you if you're too far away, so do keep that in mind. What? Uh, come on. It's not like, uh, what is it? RDR2, RDR1 horses? Okay, let me grab. And here's a neat little thing. Give me five apples. Horsey. Maybe just hold one. Horsey. Take the apple. Yeah, it does take the Okay. Okay, so... I'll go ahead and give it five apples. Okay. No, no I don't want to eat it. Will horsey eat five apples? Yes, it will. Oh, thank goodness. Oh, thank goodness. And this will help raise the uh, bond quite a lot, if I remember correctly. So, Give it a full course meal. Hi, Puppo. Good. I'm gonna pretend I pet you. I forget that Breath of the Wild does not have petting, which I hope Tears of the Kingdom has. That should be a requirement. Okay. And I think I want to make some toasted apples. Horsey, you almost came to steal my apples. I've got apples for you. Okay, there is a... There is a little... Uh, Kor Korok up there. Okay. Neato. Good to know. Hakuna Matata. What a wonderful phrase. How do I get up there? I mean, I know a way to get up there. No! Oh, directions. Or, actually, they're wild, so until you calm them, it's going to be crazy ride. But there's no feeling like quite like Taming Stallion. Trust me, I took the second place in the Hyrule Horse Taming Competition. Okay. Hey, I saw that look you gave me. Fine. 
You don't believe me? Let's go, pal. You would be right here right now. You want to challenge the second place horse rule, Hyrule horse taming comp competition winner to a tame off? You got it, mister. Uh, okay. Oh. That's a spirit. The only rule is that you must bring a wild horse back to this spot within the time limit. This area is choke full of wild horses. Any one of them will do. My record is two minutes flat, so you need to bring back a wild horse within that time. Whoa. Prepare for extreme taming. Okay, I guess I'm taming another horse. Why didn't you give me this quest before? Ah, crap. Set me on a suicide mission. I won't bet the horse tamer dude works for Gaddon. There we go. Trevor's bow is badly damaged. That's all right. Ooh, Black Stallion. That's the blue one I wanted earlier. Swear to God, if one of these guys... Come on, horsey. Stay still. You need to go this way. That way I can rub it into the guy's face. That way I can rub it into that guy's face. Amazing! But I can't believe you beat my two-minute record so easily. I mean, I won second place in the Highway Horse Navy competition. To be fair, it was just my brother and I competed. Anyway, here's the purse for winning the second official Hyrule Horse Navy competition. You earned it. 50 rupees. Okay, that was worth it. I guess there's more competition out there than I knew about. Maybe Hyrule isn't all bad after all. Alright, looks like you got yourself a new steed. You want to register it? Yes. Gotcha. Okay. Yes. Not a problem. We charge registration fee to help support our conservation efforts. Yep. 20... Okay, new wild horse. I'm just gonna name this one horse. Just horse. Ah. I right, see so you want to name this horse horse. Yes. Your right, race so is complete. Would you like to take your new horse with you? I'll board this one. Ah. Thank you. We'll see you next time. Ah, uh, nothing like capturing animals just to keep them boarded up, because I wanted to prove some. Dude, Ron. Who are you? Good evening. Don't see a whole lot of travelers passing through here. You know, with how peaceful it is around here, it's sometimes easy to forget that the world almost ended years ago. But there are still monsters wandering around, and the area near Hyrule Castle is especially dangerous. If you're going to be traveling, you should know a thing or two about elixirs. Elixirs? You can make elixirs by mixing bugs and other small creatures with monster parts. Most of them are no good for refilling your health. They can have a lot of unique effects. Some elixirs can increase your speed. Others can raise your resistance to extreme temperatures. I'm actually impressed that you made this far without any knowledge of elixirs. I can't have it on my conscience if something were to happen to you from here. So I'll give you one of mine. Hasty elixir. Nice. Using a hasty elixir, your run speed, so... Use a ha using a hasty el elixir increases your run speed. So I use it to escape from enemies or any time I need her to hurry. <laughs> The rest of it is just Hightail, Lizard, and Monster Parts, so I usually have a stock of 10 or so on hand. Nice. Very nice. You know, I might be able to get through to that shrine there just by gliding off of that. The Hadahamar. The Hadahamar. Hadahamar. The Hadahamar Shrine. The Ha Ha Shrine. 
We have arrived at the Ha Ha Shrine. Oh, that ain't gonna do shit. That will, though. Oh, yeah, I should be able to reach this easy. Did you look at that? I am so skilled. Let's examine. Let's get another shrine so we can have three spirit orbs. Because if I can get four, I get another stamina thing. Because I feel good about my hearts, right? I feel very good about my hearts. Haha, <gasps> <laughs> nice. Surviving the co I thought I said surviving the god. I'm like, are we going to fight God? In Legend of Zelda? Final boss is uh, the gods of Hyrule. Hank Hylia? I'm sorry, I fucking hate it. <laughs> To you, sets foot in the shrine. I am Ha Ha Da Ha Mar. In the name of the goddess Hylia, I challenge you. Cool. Nice. Yeah, there's nothing here. Nice. That's how it's done. Oh, crap. Okay, yeah, but I forget motion control. Okay. Nice. I got a chest. 50 purple rupees. My funds grow. Oh crap, what is this? Oh, I see what it is. Okay. So it's not just freezing pathways for myself, huh? Oh. But it's freezing pathways for this, okay. Oh, I see, I see, I see, okay. Come on, work with me here. Okay. And let's see if that works. See if that works. Yes, come on. Yes. Okay, thank goodness. I was kind of worried there for a second. It's just gonna open the gate, and that way I could go on through. Oh, I about walked off the edge. That would not have been good. Alright, is this gonna lead me right to yep. Ha the hamar, the ha ha they're themselves. Examine. Alright, so when this is no becoming this trial speaks to the premise of a hero. Ha ha ha. Sorry. In the name of the goddess Halia, I spell upon you this spirit of Yeah, yeah. I should probably put on the climbing bandana, shouldn't I? Spirit orb. May the goddess smile upon you. Yeah, I should probably put on that climbing bandana because it'll help my stamina anyway. Like the more help, the better. I mean, that's just a statement in general. But the more help, the better. Oh, sweet. The, the spikes are conveniently out of the way now. Wait a minute. 
I'm I'm fucking stupid. Oh my goodness. I mean, I got there anyway, but I could have just done the ice thing. Oh my god. Uh, okay, that's fine. We got there anyway. There's no ice here, so... I just gotta go interact with that. But first... Let me put on bandana. Okay, it only helps with climbing, not other stamina related things. Obviously, I mean, considering it's called the, the, climb, the climber's bandana. Okay, let me just climb up this stupid rock. This game sucks. <laughs> uh, it's a great game. I don't actually hate it. I'm just impressed by my own inability to think. Oh, please, don't go out. Okay. Okay, the sledgehammer is badly injured. That's all right. I saved myself, though. You know, I shouldn't make treacherous climbs like this. Unless I'm prepared, which I am not. Seems Mouse isn't able to come. Where the fuck is Mouse? Where the fuck is my horse? I don't care about your directions. I want to find my horse. Take horse. Max, uh, horses. Mm -hmm. You wanted mouse, right? Yeah. Thank you. I don't know where my horse went. It just disappeared. Oh. And there you go. Thanks for choosing us for all your horsey needs. If a horse gets spooked or doesn't like where it's at, it might shut down or refuse to move at all. If that happens, you can target while mounted and then force the horse to s move step by step. Yes, just be sure you don't put your horse in a dangerous situation. Yep. Never. I would never do that. Actually, I don't want to put my horse in a dangerous situation for a couple of reasons. Okay. Now I have a horse! That makes traveling a lot faster. I feel like I'm going the wrong way. But now my bond with my horse is stronger than ever. Little twin bridge. Oh god, horse. Slow down! For fuck's sake. Holy crap. You're gonna get yourself killed. Okay, it's not motion controlled. I can't confirm. Right, let me just check my map. Oh, I definitely was going the wrong way. Oh, ho, ho. I don't know where I would have gone, but it definitely wouldn't have been where I needed to. Oh, so you do not steer well. Oh, is this what this nice little convenient climbing thing is for? Mouse? I don't know what the convenience of that is. Oh, thank goodness for ladders. At least you can climb a ladder without having to worry about stamina. A rusty broadsword. Arrow. No, there's something else, right? 
I don't want to take a rusty broadsword anyway. Hopefully that's not important. Yeah, I can't even get... Yeah, I can't even get there. Ah, oh, crap. That would have been so cool. Okay. Careful with the horse. Be a very, very careful. So I'll have to get a uh, good horse eventually, but like I said, this is a good start. That one is very good, yeah. it looked like, but my only problem is I don't have the stamina to get it. So I'm gonna have to, I'm gonna have to focus on a stamina wheel first. There's a chest up there. There goes Beetle. up here oh fancy chest opal okay that's not bad more selling more sellables Dang it. I wonder if you could do that though I wonder if you could glide down onto your horse I'll tell you what though, that'd be a heck of a way. It's nice being, it's nice and bright out. Of course it is. Examine it. Kakarito Village and Hedno Village. Okay, well Kakariko is where we want, so. I guess we, I guess we go off of this path. Fine. Cross the bridge. Huh. Unless, of course, this bridge ends up having uh, monsters on it. Then you are right. But no, we get to meet a very certain character. A certain character here soon. A character that we'll definitely want to talk to. Oh shit! Don't let that meat go to waste! Oh god, oh god, oh god! This horse is hard to control! Alright. Chickaloo tree nut. Cool! I don't even know where my, uh. I don't even know where my arrow went. That's all right. Oh, there he is. There's the the tree boy himself. Shakalaka. Stay here. Hets, it's Hestu. A Korok. Shakalaka, you you can see me? Of course, I can see you. Shalaza Shalaka. It's been a hundred years since anyone has been able to see me. I'm Hestu and I need your help. Yeah, so I can probably help. Those monsters over there stole my beloved maracas. I think they're still on the other side of those rocks. I can't use my powers without them, Shoko. So please, please get my maracas back from them. Of course. The priceless maracas. And of course we're going to help Hestu. Hetsu. Okay. Oh god. Okay, nope. Out of here. 
Leave my horse be. Oh my god, Link, block! Okay, go, okay. I'm blocking, ain't I? Soldier's bow. Oh god, okay, uh, heal. Heal. I could do eat this. And I have an apple. But I don't need apple. I don't need that much health. Okay, chicken and tree nut. Soldier's block door. Okay, that shield's definitely been coming to use. Oh, were you about to come help? I saw someone. I was close. I thought you sure, for sure I was done for, but I somehow managed to narrowly escape death. This is show my thanks. Energized glazed mushrooms. I didn't even... Do I know you? That, that, never mind. The real prize is in here. The maracas. Hey, champ. I know you got hit a couple times. So uh, please take this apple. Or not. The apple's rolling away. Okay. Apples and arrows. Nice. I'm gonna go ahead and get these maracas. Hestu's, he, Hestu's maracas. Hestu's beloved maracas. He's been shaking them since he was two years old. Good on ya, Hestu. Good on ya. Whee! Hold on, I gotta pick up some the monster parts. Sakalaka, those are... Those are my maracas. Please give them to me. No, the power is mine. The mine alone. Shalaka. But wait, there's something wrong with my maracas. The Korok seed inside are gone. How am I supposed to dance now, Shoko? I had just one Korok seed. I could sing, dance, and use my powers to help you. You see, I have the power of inventory expansion. So let me know if you find some Korok seeds. Yep. So that's what the Korok seeds are for is that you can expand your inventory. So I think for me, personally, ooh. I can just drop the Boko shield whenever. Children of the forest must have taken the Korok seeds from my beloved Maracas. Never thought I'd let be the target one in their prank, Shoko. But wait, do you have a Korok seed? You do get. I, I have to take a break from the S2 voice. It's a little hard. Give me one. Okay. Of course, I should make your inventory bigger in return. Yes. Shalaka, so which dash do you want to. More slots in? I think the weapon stash would be actually pretty good. Oh, yeah. Shaky Shaka. And we now have more inventory on our weapons. Da, na, 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 na. <gasps> Weapon stash has been expanded, Shalaka. I still smell Korok seeds on you. You want me to expand your inventory? Not the bow stash. <laughs> Thank you, giant broccoli man. We'll expand the shields next. The bow staff has been expanded, Shalaka. Oh, look at the time. I need to get back before Grandpa yells at me, Shoko. Sorry I have to go, but I still need cor more Korok seeds, so bring some to Korok Filler Forest if you find any. I will. Thank you. Priceless maracas have been obtained. Which, good news, 
There is actually a one up ahead. Okay, so we got another chance for the Korok. So, let me just keep going. Because we're now approaching uh, Kakarika Village. Oh, there's two. There's two chances for a Korok seed. No. Yep. There we go. Yahaha. Yeah, yeah. Korok seed. The smell. Okay. Yep. We've already read the description last uh, last stream. sledgehammer or anything to mine out, so. Yep, that's it. There we go. That's two Korok seeds now in our possession. Cover stamina. It's fine. Twee hee. Twee hee indeed, but. Damn it, no. I want those arrows. Arrows are always nice to have. Okay, fine. I guess I'm not taking these arrows. Okay. Sweet heat, I don't care. Okay, but you know what? We got one arrow. One arrow is good. I'm not going to spend the whole game trying to get one little arrow. I don't think. It's not too for, for again, is it? It's not. Okay. Just wanted to make sure. Better safe than sorry. Can my horsey come with me? Okay, horsey. Bless me. Ouch. Traveler, I'm sorry, but I seem to have twisted my ankle. Let me see here. I'm sorry you had to see me like that. Hey, Traveler. Where did you get that object hanging from your waist? Well, you see. Yes, I see. That Sheikah Slate is a symbol. It means you are the hero of legend. Though there are few who know of such legends anymore. But we Sheikah have been waiting for you for a very long time. Please, for all else, I must insist that you meet our lady, our, our leader, Lady Impa. Where is she? Of course, the, the building in a very distance. Lady Impa's house is below Lantern Falls, just over there. Oh yeah, one, of course, the one below the waterfall. In any case, it was a real honor to meet, meet you. I suppose you're used to that, having lived as long as you have. Indeed, I have. Yeah, totally. I'm glad that we got here, because my favorite, one of my favorite uh, sets of. Uh... Oh, yeah, and we got a. Uh... Yeah! New clothes for your outfit. Enchanted is open for business every day of the year. Uh, oh, my, look at your face. You are totally my type. Hi. Oh, and you even have a Sheikah Slate on your hip. Wait, huh? A Sheikah Slate? Isn't that like an incredible thing that only incredible people can have? I'm not sure what this all means, mister, but it seems you're a great deal more important than you appear. Yes, indeed. Thank you for recognizing me. 
Oh yeah, the secret armor's in here. How you doing tunics in here as well? Got 120 rupees. What a steal! Thanks, they're great on you, really. Everything here is part of that special, uh, the specially curated Claret collection. Please take your time looking. Claret collection is a high-end collection curated by me, Claret. But of course, I personally selected each and every item in here using my flawless fashion sense. It's all highly recommended. Each item has its own unique features and abilities, so take a look. Good luck. Boy. Nice. And the highly in trousers. Thanks, take good care of it. Is that lovely? It's a limited edition enchanted exclusive. While you wear it, your foot... Your footsteps are nearly, sa are nearly soundless, so it's perfect for hunting and stuff. Oh, but it offers very little defense. Small price for extra stealth. But it's expensive as hell, though. So I need to save up on rupees if I want to get it. But the Sheikah armor is so cool. But I do like the Hylian, uh, Hylian set as well. Probably my favorite look in the game. One of my favorite looks, actually. Whoa, whoa. Yes, hello. You there. Who are you? How dare you trespass upon Lady Impa's abode? Hmm. Is that a Sheikah slate? But that would mean you are... No, it's not possible, can it? Oh. Please forgive us for behaving so rudely. Of course, we have heard the legend from Lady Impa ourselves. Go ahead and... Please, friend, go ahead and step inside. But first... Hold. Another Korok seed. I forgot about that one. Yahaha! Ha. Now we have three. So we can expand inventory twice. Once for the shield and once for whatever we decide to do. Oh, there's Paya. A man! Oh, my voice cracked. I am so sorry. Huh? Is that... It's a secret slate. Could you be the hero my grandmother told me about? What was his name? Ling, Ling, um... Oh, it's not that I forgot. I'm just bad at speaking. Uh, for me, my name is Pi... 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 Oh, my name is Pi... Yeah, I got it out. I know I should be able to say that easily, seeing as how it's my own name and all. I'm so sorry. Anyway, my grandmother's been awaiting your return ever since I was little. But please hurry inside. Okay, let's open. There's Impa. So, you're finally awake. It has been quite a long time, Link. I am much older now, but you remember me, don't you? That be Impa. What's the matter? You are looking as though at me as though I am a stranger to you. Those eyes, they lack the light of familiarity. It is I, courageous one, Impa. Surely you must at least remember the name Impa. I see, so you've lost your memory. Oh, it matters not. In fact, that may actually be a blessing in disguise for the time being. Dearest Link, please come a little closer. I'll smack the memory into you. Oh. A hundred years ago. Oh. Yes, a hundred years ago, the kingdom of Hyrule was destroyed. After you fell, Princess Zelda's final wish was to place you in a sacred slumber. And then all alone, alone she went to face Ganon. Before Princess Zelda went to nobly meet her fate, she entrusted me with some words she wished to say to you. I've been hating one hundred years to deliver the princess's final message. Oh. Or message. However... These words would the princess risk her life to leave you. Well, if you are not to, if you are to hear him, you must be prepared to risk your life as well. I am afraid that burden may be too much to bear while you're still without your memories. I leave the choice to you. When you feel you are ready to receive the princess's message, return to me. Oh. That's the words that the princess risked her life to impart to you. I cannot pass them on to someone who lacks conviction. 
Are you prepared to risk your life for the greater good? I've got no choice. I mean, how else are we going to progress the plot? <laughs> ha! Now I remember your, to your name, yet you are as intent as ever to change, charge forward with only courage and justice at your, on your side. I give you like a day before you die. You have not changed a bit. Once a hero, always a hero. Yeah. Very well. Since you have lost your memory, I will recount for you all that has happened. The history of the royal family of Hyrule is also the history of Calamity All Ganon. Right. Oh, hi, the Purple Sky. How you doing? Welcome to the stream. Over the ages. I say thank you for this so much for hopping in. How are you doing today? Time and time again, by a warrior wielding the soul of a hero. Right, I hope, hope you've been doing well. Who carries the blood of the goddess? With the passage of time, each conflict with Ganon faded into legend. So listen closely. I'm doing good. How are you? I'll do it pretty good. Just be chilling, vibing. Thousand years ago. So, so far, it hasn't been too bad of a day, so. This is always Hyrule a good thing. Hyrule was then blossoming as a highly advanced civilization. Even the most powerful monsters posed little threat to the denizens of the realm. Okay, the that's cool. thought it wise to utilize their technological prowess to ensure the safety. Well, again, thank you. Welcome to the stream again, because I saw you were a first time chatter, so return. happy to have you here. They constructed four mechanical wonders that came to be known as the Divine Beasts. Oh, you mean the ones they that are apparently under Ganon's control. A legion of autonomous weapons called Guardians. Oh, I met a couple of those. They're nice. The Divine Beasts were piloted by four individuals of exceptional skill from across the land. And Thanks, hello. Hey, no problem. No problem at all. Ganon was forged. But then they fucked up. Upon Ganon's inevitable return to Hyrule, the princess and the hero fought alongside these four champions against this ancient evil. The Guardians were tasked with protecting the hero as the Divine okay. Beasts unleashed a furious attack upon their terrible foe. Ah. I assume it went well. I mean, I've only been asleep for a hundred years and... And when the hero wielding the sword that seals the darkness delivered his final blow, the princess used her sacred Are you a new player in, of Breath of the Wild? No, I've played it before, uh, but I've been looking for a re uh, to replay it for a long time now. And with Tears of the Kingdom coming out, I figured I'd go ahead and stream it, because I do enjoy this game. And plus, there's, pl there's some stuff in here I have not done, so the stuff I haven't done, I definitely want to do in this playthrough on Twitch. And of course, once I'm done with Breath of the Wild, then it's on to Age of Calamity. Once that's done, we wait for Tears of the Kingdom. A hundred years ago, in preparation for the foretold revival of Ganon, we strove to follow the lead of our ancestors for 10,000 years prior. But in the end, despite our best efforts and careful planning, we underestimated his power. In order to avoid ever making that great mistake, again, the princess left you these words. Free the four divine beasts. That's what she said. The four divine beasts are the ancient Sheikah weapons wielded by the four champions who Ganon defeated. Honestly, Link, were you not listening to the story I just told you? The divine beasts Van Rudia, Rudania, controlled by Daruk of the Gorons. The divine beast Van Meadow, controlled by Rivali of the Rito. Divine Beast Van Ruda, controlled by Mifa of the Zora. 
and a divine beast von Naboris. Controlled, hold on, I'll be right back. For real? All right, I have returned. Sorry about that. Let's say I am back. Also, Purple Sky, thank you so much for the follow. Thank you so much. I'm planning to get AOC soon. I planned played the demo and I really liked it. Yeah. ALC looks like a lot of fun. I mean, I like the warrior style games too. Uh, I have just oh, I have two actually. I've got Persona Five Strikers, is a warrior style game, and then I have One Piece Pirate Warriors Four, which is one of my favorite games to play. It's a super fun one, absolutely fun. So I'm I'm definitely looking forward to Age of Calamity. Well, plus I get to replay as you get to play as the champions in that one, you know, or both. Uh, uh, who's on the screen apparently you know and the character I really wanted in Smash if I'm gonna be honest I would have loved to see her burst in Smash and the volley and all that Impa looks broken Impa looks absolutely broken <laughs> yeah. it would be extremely ill devised to face Ganon without the power of the divine beast to help you you must infiltrate the divine beast that you were stolen by Ganon you were stolen away by Ganon 100 years ago and bring them back to our side more information about these divine beasts can be found by locating the four races scattered and cross Hyrule. Oh, thank you. Oh. The Chica Slate will guide you on your way. You must go where it tells you and meet with each leader there. Mm. Seems that to me that your secret slate is not yet complete. The device Princess Zelda left to you, you is your guide and also your memory. Now let's see. Someone at the research lab in a Tenno village might be able to help you. Tenno village. Which we saw on the way here. Well, we didn't see. We saw a sign pointing towards it. The location signing on the eastern edge of Hate is Hateno village. It's a small village. One of the very few places that avoided suffering significant damage during the Great Calamity. Locked me mementos. You are, Princess Zelda, you are Princess Zelda's only hope in High Rules as well. You cannot turn back now. Follow your heart and seize your destiny. Seek out Impa complete. Thank you, Impa. It's like no other quest from you. No. Oh yeah, I can read. Uh, can't you read Pia's diary? This looks like Pia's diary. Seems you only just started writing it. Uh, now nah, we'll, we'll be respectful. 
For now. Examine. Journal of Various Worries. First page. Well, my wife left me today. The last thing she said to me was, What's more important, the cuckoos or me? I chose the cuckoos. <laughs> the bowman. <laughs> Damn. Damn. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Next page. A painter unfamiliar to any of us has arrived in the village. He claims he is searching for the Great Fairy's Fountain, and that's near where the village spirit protector resides. We must make sure the outsider doesn't learn of the location of the, fount the fountain or the two shrines near it. Anonymous father of two. Next. Uh, the new guy in town looks like he already really do knows how to use tune a bow. I hope he comes by and knocks an arrow for me. It's been way too long. Lonely arrow girl. Next page. Day in, day out, the outside barking people. I'm outside barking people into the shop. I don't re mind, really. It's a good money, and busying myself helps to numb the pain. Oh, oh. But the only thing that really helps me feel better is walking among the fireflies. Fortunately, we've now been asked to not walk around at night because it's dangerous. I didn't know how I can cope. I don't know how I can cope without the fireflies. The struggling shop girl, okay. There's a precious heirloom that has. Been passed down through my family for generations. Recently, I've begun to hear voices telling me that the heirloom has an important destiny. It's going to happen soon. It makes me nervous, but I can feel it in my bones. Okay, let's go ahead and stop reading. Now that we know that the village's worries. Where are you at, Paya? Nice you. Oh, it's you, Master Link. Please don't sneak up on me like that. Is something the matter? Do you need something for me? What you doing? Uh. I'm just polishing the guardian deities. These deities are like signposts that guide us through our lives. Master Link, I want you to know that the path you are walking down is one we should all follow. Okay, sorry, I'm back. You're good, you're good. I said I got back recently myself, so all good. But in case you weren't here uh, when I said it, I want to thank you for the follow. I say I really do appreciate it. Always nice to see both new and old faces around here. I'm afraid I can't. I'm doing stuff like this. I'm afraid doing stuff like this is the only way, thing I can do to help you. Oh, you're doing great, Paya. You're doing great. Oh, there's the painter, dude. Oh, that chicken about got burned. Holy crap, this dude. Are you sorry to bother you, but are you a fellow traveler? As for me, I just love art. The fact that I'm traveling the world in search of beautiful... In fact, ah. I'm traveling the world in search of beautiful landscapes, just between you and me. I hear there's a great fairy fountain somewhere near this village. I hear it's breathtakingly beautiful. The aesthetics aside, they also say the place could bestow some kind of mysterious power on people. Ah. However, since I'm an outsider, I can't get anyone to tell me any more details than that. These villagers never leave the safety of their village, so travelers like me are treated with suspicion. But I won't give up. Oh, and if I manage to find out anything, I'll be sure to let you know. That's fine. I don't need you to tell me. It's my time to watch what's he Hest 2 dance 1,000 times. <laughs> Heck yeah. Dance, dance, dance. Say He just likes to do his little jig. S2 does. I know, I got three Korok seeds now, so I get to watch it at least two times. Ooh, that's significant. Is there a rock near here? Oh, there's an owl. Okay, I screwed up. Well, no, that's definitely, that's definitely gotta be if I can find a rock or a cuckoo. Or an apple. That might work too. Oh, there's the cuckoo, man. Kato. Sir, Sir Link. My cuckoos. My precious cuckoos. <gasps> they haven't come home yet. Dance, dance, revolution has to it. I would totally play that. I would most definitely play that. Even if there's only, like, one song on there. 
I would totally play Dance Dance Revolution Hestu Edition. The Hestu DLC. Now that my wife wants nothing to do with me, my Kukos are my only emotional support. Oh, uh, what do I do? You said it for me. I I'll go find them. Really? Thank you so much. I have 10 Kukos total. Hopefully, you'll be able to find them all. I found a couple of them on the way here. Kuko! Oh god, I thought he was doing an art attack on me. I thought man was ready to play Spatoon. That's not sorry. Just trying to help. Alright, let's go find them Kukos. Pot lid. I don't want a pot lid. I'm already Tracer. I don't. I'm already with him. I don't know why I'm seeing that one, but I don't know why I'm seeing an Overwatch song when it has nothing to do with Legend of Zelda, unless there's like a Legend of Zelda collab. Even then, I still wouldn't play it. Nice. Right, cool. hold on. We're almost there. We're almost there. Hold your horses. There we go. That is eight or two. Up oh, I hear. Well, that was easy. Kukos can fly. Nice. Okay. And we saw one on the way here, so might as well go get that Kuko. I don't think it's the one I saw, but it's one regardless. I could be wrong though, this could have been the one I saw. I just like fly with the Kukos. Now, is there a Kuko in your house, by chance? There is not. Okay. I was curious, because you never know. You never know what them Kukos be. There might be one. Oh, yep, there's one right here. Perfect! be in the pumpkin patch. I feel like the dude might get mad at me. Okay. I brought four or five back. I don't know. Looks like man's on a mission, so I'll leave him be for now. I'll keep finding Kukos. These chickens can't stay hidden from me forever. See, like this one. Nice. Does he have 10 Kukos total? Or 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Oh, well. I hope he has 10 total. Oh, was this might be a bit of a pain? Actually, not really. This this is actually one of the easiest, easiest question question mark easiest side missions that are, is in the game. Oh, there's a shrine. Damn it! Wait. Sorry to cut down your tree. I just needed that apple. And I'm too lazy to, uh... You know, I can do the shrine real quick. I can get the, uh, fourth spirit, uh, spirit orb. 
and get myself uh, some stamina, a stamina wheel thing. So as cool as a heart container would be, or yeah, I wouldn't mind a heart container eventually, but I can do without for now. Oh, it's gonna teach us about dodges, like. Okay, wait. No, I know what this. I know what this one is. Okay, so we're about to learn about a very fun mechanic here that I never use. You set foot in this shrine. I am Taloneg. I share with you my knowledge that it may help you do shit. Talos teachings. Shield of the mind's eye. Okay, get rid of the Boku shield. You're done. We definitely want this shield. And... We... Now that Dance Dance Revolution has 2 edition is done, it's time to, to Silverheart. Nice! Heck yeah! I wish you luck in your silver hunt. I said I have yet to find any silver myself. But dang it, I'm not I'm not looking too hard for silver at the moment, but Oh boy. What I am doing is fighting this this boy. Use a side hop to avoid enemy attacks. This will create an opening for you that you can use to strike back. Fury Rush! Nice. Do a backflip to avoid enemy attacks and create an opening that strike back. Hey, let's do it. Backflip time. Time the Fury Rush! Nice. I didn't mean to capture that, but oh well. Normally I would just do it for the money, but now I'm doing it for the gear. Nice. I mean, it is a good source of money, but... Nice. It's just gonna blow up. Build up your power, then release it to unleash a charge attack. Catch your enemies in this motion to damage them. I definitely want the Guardian Sword. Guardian Swords are super nice. You know what? I say I can't remember what gear needs the uh, silver. You have done well to learn these crucial skills. Now proceed. Give me a second. I need these ancient screws. I need them for important weapon stuff later. What do I get? So opal, okay, that ain't bad. Okay. Just like the royal swords and stuff. Oh, nice. Heck yeah. Oh, I can't wait to get the royal stuff eventually. You triumph over the test. You triumph over the test subverts a prophecy of ruin. Here, take this spirit orb in the name of the goddess Helia. Because cause I lo looted Hyrule Castle surprisingly barren. I say that's kind of surprising if it's barren. I mean, I I want to probably next couple streams probably visit Hyrule Castle. Like definitely not to go to Ganon. That definitely not that by that means I'm not gonna be able to fight Ganon this early on. I could try. You know what? It'd be fun to fight him with a stick, but I feel like that wouldn't go too well. Well, thank you for Spirit Orb, by the way. May the goddess smile upon you. Well, no, for now, I mean, I'm good for, I'm, I've got some good equipment, I feel like. I, I do like the Hylian uh, traveler set, traveling set. And I forgot about this, the Eightfold Sword and the Mind Eye Shield, too. Those are super nice. 
Not the best things, but still very nice. Well, no, I do hope your quest for silver goes well. I, for some reason, thought a blood move was happening. Oh, why did I, for some reason, think that? Okay. Now I just gotta go this way. Oh, there is another shrine here. No, I think that ain't a shrine. That's just the, uh... That's the great fairy. Go ahead and do this one. Examine. Boy. Sweet boy. Please, listen to my story. I'll pass. <laughs> this is being ass. I am the great fairy Katera. This place was once a beautiful spring, but as time passed, fewer and fewer travelers arrived to offer me rupees. As a result, my power has abandoned me. I'm nearly powerless now, so I beg your help. I need rupees to become whole again. All I need is 100 rupees. Once my powers have been restored, I can help you do great things, my boy. Now, if you have the rupees, I'm the mova to me quickly. In order for me to regain my power, I need 100 rupees. Okay. But, like, do they actually need the rupees, though, like, to regain power? I mean, I'm definitely going to do it still. But are they just doing, oh, woe is me, woe is me. Give me your money, please. I am set. I need money just for this reason. Like, my power's gone, even though it's not. Okay, here's the rupees. You are quick to snatch them up. Thank you. You are too kind. Ah, oh, the power. It's overflowing. Now, I feel like they should make silver hynixes. You know, that wouldn't be too bad. Oh, there's the great fairy. One of them, at least. Oh, what a feeling. That first breath of fresh air after an eternity of decay. It's just so intoxicated. Thanks to you, I've been returned to my former glory. As they say, one good burn deserves another. I could help you, boy. Allow me to enhance your clothing. It's the least I could do, but I would need the necessary materials. Mm. The power available to me, I should be able to enhance your clothing a little bit. Enhance away. Oh, yeah, we can just ah. get these enhanced. Mm. All right, let me do my thing. <sighs> yeah. Enhanced. Helium tunic, a common garb popular in Hyrule, especially among travelers. It is light yet sturdy fabric, doesn't limit the movement. The Great Fairy increases defense by ah. one level. Dolphin is just a bit stronger now. Oh, you've heard about set bonuses, right? How a set of clothes have all that have all been enhanced twice can could have a bonus, but only if you wear the whole set. Well, not all sets have bonuses. Do you want me to enhance any other clothes? Yes, please, please do. I have two Hylian trousers. Ah. Nice. Okay, mm. let's do it. All right, let me do my thing. Enhance away. Ah. Mm. All right, let me do my thing. <sighs> All right, now we got a full set. I'm sure I go ahead and enhance. Um, I'm definitely. I already have a good set of the uh, the climber's bandana. Might not be too bad. That way, if I ever want to enhance it twice, I can do that. No thanks. I have sisters out there in the world like me. They've lost much of their power. If you're able to restore the power to them as well, 
we'd be then be able to enhance your clothing even more. See you later. <laughs> Goodbye. I, you know, that's still a good deal, and I still feel like I got robbed. <laughs> Give me a fairy. All right, this fairy will fly it from your pouch and heal all your wounds in the moment you lose your last heart. It's easily mistaken for a firefly at, at first, but it glows in daylight as well as night. Blue nightshade. A uh, plant that grows in quiet areas of Hyrule at night. It gives you off a soft glow. Cook it to increase your... Yeah. Ooh, we also got these. Silent princesses. Silent Princess, this lovely flower was said to have been a favorite of the Princess of Hyrule. Once feared to have gone extinct, it's recently been spotted growing in the wild. It's a sign. Ooh, Endura Carrot. We got carrots. I leave out if we know what carrots are. Who doesn't know what a carrot is? Harry, I'm just gonna steal your kid from you here real quick. Say, so don't mind me. More blue nightshade. I, you know, we could definitely use that for uh, some stale. And I guess if I heard correctly, there's a second. Yep, there's a second. You know? I don't know if I've ever gotten this. I don't remember this at all. You know, I don't think I've gotten this shrine before. Maybe I have and I just don't remember, but I really I feel like I would remember. Oh, yeah, two juice. Not a chance. <laughs> Give me your meat. You don't take fall damage thing. Okay. I was hoping you did. I hope I'm not going too far away from that. I definitely don't want to leave my horse behind. Well. Oh, yeah, that's a... Uh... Okay, there we go. I said, I know how to get, get it if you're up for it. Um... Maybe. Give me one quick sec, though. I want to see if I can figure it out for myself here uh, first. I do want to mark that. That way I know where that one's at. And plus, I kind of want to see what's up here anyway. See, I know this is not... I, I doubt this is the area to get that. The ball. Hmm. Ah. Okay, I think. I'm okay. Just want to scan here real quick. I definitely don't want to chop down the whole forest. I don't even have... I don't think my blades have the durability for it. Okay, just gonna take a look around. I said, I might take you up on your offer here. But give me one sec here. I still want to see if I can... Possibly figure it out. Yeah. 
Well, wait, but wait. One less. What? Question. Before I ask outright, what is it? Before I just ask outright. Is it something you have to get from the village and carry all the way up here? Okay. Yeah, okay. Sweet. So let me just go back down to the village then real quick. Nope. I missed it. I do. I missed it. Yeah, well. Okay, well. There's a well. There's a catch to this. It's from the village, but you don't got to carry it. Oh. No, I didn't mean a well. I, I know I know you didn't mean a well. Like I I, I, I figured you meant like Yeah Yeah, well as in well as in but So I didn't think there was a well. I don't even think there is a well around this area anyway. Otherwise that'd be a pretty long trek. But you, I don't carry it. Huh. Wait, I could always, I know I can do a side quest here. Actually, wait. No, hold on. Before I do anything, before I forget, I do... Oh. No. Stamina vessel. I can give you a hint. All right. All right. Um. Hold on. Is it the painter dude? If it's not the painter dude, I I'll let you give me the hint still. Hiya. Oh. Hiya. Okay. I guess I'll go talk to Pyatt. My precious Kukos. I, I guess I want to see how much do I have still. So part of this army you can play in and those things are after our lady Impa. Yes. Kuko update. What? Oh. I see. I just want to go home. Um, do you want to tell me how much are left? Oh, it's this thing. But Master Link, is anything the matter? Anything at all? Can I help in any way? What's that ball? This, this priceless artifact here? Is that what you want to know about? This is a Sheikah heirloom that we have long protected. The hero, as chosen by the Sheikah heirloom, will be gifted the blessing of antiquity. With these words as our guide, we have watched over the sacred artifact since my grandmother's grandmother's time and ever since her grandmother's time grandmother's time before that we, it, the list keeps on going on and on I cannot say that I entirely know the meaning of these words but now I, that I think about it the hero is chosen by the Sika Slate heirloom could it be please don't hesitate to let me know if I can ever be a service also what's your story you and I mean you want to know my story well my name is Paya the reason I was named Pia is because I have a birthmark sacred like papaya seed. Where is it? Well, it's kind of... Ah, Master Link. I advise you to change the subject. I'll answer it someday, just just not today. Please don't hesitate to let me know if I can ever be a service. I'm good, thanks. I do want this ball, though. Impa. I want to talk to you. You're still here? Princess Zelda gives the secret slate. It's only... Yep. I had to hurry for it to head to head head village. Oh. Nah, she'll be fine. She's been doing it for a hundred years. Master Link, is there anything to matter? Anything at all? I mean... Yes, would you mind carrying this for me? Oh, wait, I can tell you what you do if you're really stuck. I think... Okay, now. Sorry. 
I'm good, thanks. Okay, do I have... Okay, also, I'll let you... I will let you help me on this, because I don't think I'm going to solve this on my own. So... So ignore the no back seating tag in here. The back seating is allowed right now. The back seating pass has been handed out. I should actually make that a thing. <laughs> Just make it a redeem. Like... Like, not a redeem, but something neat. Just... Just like, because usually my streams are back seating, so I'm like, okay, the back seating pass has been brought out. Make it like a visual thing. Oh no, what do you do? Uh, to get it. I know it's definitely not strike it. Just do all the town quests and it'll trigger an event. Oh, okay. Interesting. Good thing. Okay, they say a great fairy fountain. Now here's where the last taking. Too bad, I just can't figure out the exact location, but I'm not gonna give up. I know where it's at, if you wanna follow me. Okay, I see... ...what to possibly do here. So there's the different... ...the different troubles in that book. Yeah! Ooh. You can't it right this way. Or do you, would you like fireflies? Want some pumpkins? Yes, I would like some pumpkins. But, oh, kid. Hi. Where's Wint's food? I'm bored. Wanna play? Ooh. Yeah, what will it be? What will it be? Hide and seek. Ah. Yay! I'm gonna hide. But I've gotta go home to Sis when it's dinner time, okay? Okay, I know one of the hiding places. I do remember one of them. But none this quest before. Okay, it's either... Behind Impus House or underneath is one of the places, I believe. Alright, let me just sneak through. I mean, I might as well grab some mushrooms while I'm here. But I do know there's like a few different hiding places you can do. So it's just, I'm going to go, go look. Every nook and every cranny. We are going to complete hide and seek one way or another. Not in, unless. Oh, there's that kid. I don't think Coda counts because I didn't do it and still worked it. But if you're 100% anything, you should do it anyway. Yeah. Okay. Then again, I think Coda is one you can do any toint too. So that I think that's why it's not a requirement is that you can do those missions, the hide and seek tag mission, at any time. Who knows, I might find a cuckoo while I'm on, while I'm journeying to find Coda. Oh god, did not mean to walk on your crops. I am sorry, sir. Have a great day. Oh, hey, mouse, what's good? Don't worry, we'll leave here at some point. Just not yet. I can pick up. I can break bases. Uh oh, I'm stuck. Help! The link is stuck. I repeat, the link is stuck. Okay, the link is unstuck. Good news. Good news. Yeah! Yeah! My precious cuckoos. Wee woo wee woo per Exactly! The link was stuck. Now he's now now I'm free though. So, Link's two greatest weapons. 
but in between, like, in between cracks that are in between spaces, like an in between, I don't know what I'm saying anymore. I give up. <laughs> but no, the first weakness was uh, the plateau, because we couldn't get off of it. Now we found the second weakness, which we overcame that as well. So, oh. Dang, you can't be hiding in. You don't hide in the buildings, no. Oh, you're asleep. You look like you're having a good time. I just kind of want to see what all, what's on all these buildings anyway. Oh, yeah. It's, uh, well, obviously, I could tell. Like, there's potions, or elixirs, and all that. There's the food, the clothing, there's the inn. There's no weapon shop. Probably for the best. Probably. Oh. I was like, oh, well, this kid is good at hiding. I give credit where credit's due. No way the kid's out here. There's no way. Absolutely not possible. I do at least know that's something. Oh, I just like, yes. Hold on, I gotta mark these. Okay, where's that third one? There's the third one. Yay, we got, we got some more shrines marked so we can go hit those. Okay, this kid is good. I give credit where credit's due. Now, what if they're hiding in a very obvious spot? I thought I checked every... Unless... There's one area I haven't checked yet that I know of. Like, because there's the up area where the fairy, fairy, fairy fountain is. That's an area I haven't checked yet. Yeah, it's a torch. I can't carry it, though. I imagine it would be an area that counts, too. Is that because I can't remember where all she hides. I know behind, like, me, uh, Mipa's house. Mitha's house. Well, not Mitha. Mitha is the, uh, is Link's fish girlfriend. Uh, Impa. I know she likes to hide behind there from time to time. Nah, she wouldn't be in a great fairy fountain. I know Panda Dude uh, has a quest that goes up here. Like, you show them where it's at. Alright, kid. I'm finding you one way or another. I'm just gonna Rito. I'm just gonna go for the Rito strategy. Just fly around. I swear, if this strategy works... I thought the strategy was gonna work. Dane, oh well. You know, it was worth a shot. You know, the Rito strategy. Oh, saving. Uh oh. I think I'm about to run out of time here. Why is this kid so good at hide and seek? Oh. I'm going home. What? Wait, when did you. Wait. Wait, wait a minute, wait. Did you just stop playing hide and seek? Or were you here the whole time? Am I, oh, hold on. Wait one second. No, what the hell, no, I want answers. 
I want nothing. I want all my the answers. Hey, how many cuckoos are left? Even if just one counter won't do. Sadly, only nine have turned. Okay, there's one cuckoo left. Okay, we'll find the one cuckoo. That way we can get that quest completed. But where the hell was that kid hiding? Or was she there the whole time and I'm just blind? I don't know. I'm questioning myself. I am losing my mind here. Like, hell, I don't think, think Ganon could find her if he tried. Like, he could be destined, you know, he could be determined to destroy every person in all of Hyrule. Like, whether it be Hylian, Zora, Rito, uh, Goron, and fellow... Um, give me one quick sec here. I can't remember. Okay. But no, that's. If he, he could be determined to destroy everyone and everything in Hyrule. And that one girl would be the lone surviving. The, the one survivor. Because he wouldn't be able to find her. Ooh, what is this? Sneaky river snail. Nice. Wait, it's nighttime now. Does that mean... Oh, hey, there she goes. I have a feeling her quest can be activated here soon. So let's wait. I used to go out and I'd catch fireflies. They fly away quickly, so you have to sneak up on them slowly. It's more than fun. It's magical. Aww. That's all in the past. Now there are monsters around the village and rumors that the Eid clan is that nearby and active. That's why I'm forced to stay inside when it's dark instead of chasing the night. I wish I could do something. <laughs> oh, I wish that too for you. Ooh, a hoe. A farming hoe. Wait, is the farming hoe better? The farming hoe is better than my nice manchi sword? My goodness. Who would have thought? I mean, I really would not have thought. And I will eventually go exploring up those waterfalls. I am going to try to get top of uh, Impa's house. I just want to see if I can find anything there. My gamer instincts are telling me to explore that house. Ooh. Just calm down. Just, uh, regain your composure here. Okay. My composure has been regained. Now let me look. Even the cuckoo's not up here. There's got to be something, right? There was nothing. There's like one last cuckoo somewhere. I don't even know where that one last cuckoo is. That's gonna drive me crazy. What's the cuckoo's behind the guy's house? Nope, there it is. Okay. Speak of the devil, we found it. Okay. Okay, we're gonna throw this last cuckoo in. Hi! Yep, let's go talk to him. Oh, wait. that's not right. Oh, you're not the right guy. You aren't part of the Yiga clan, aren't you? No, I'm not, I swear. I'm just pulling your leg. You look so serious, I couldn't help but get 
get you good at... We call those who swear allegiance to Clan to Ganon, the Eagle Clan, eh? Uh. Well, let's just say they don't take kindly to those who would stand against Ganon. Seems they're active again, ever since that big earthquake the other day. But don't worry, I don't think you're part of that awful Yuki clan. I can figure that much out by looking at you. Please don't hold it against me. Here, take this in exchange. Fortified pumpkin. <laughs> Fortified pumpkins are Kakariko's village's specialty. Put my heart and soul into every one of them. They're delicious. If you want more, I can give you some. Just stop by the field and say hello. Okay. Well, you're not home. Oh, you're over here. Okay. Oh, Kato. But more importantly, Link, you can hear the sound of a cuckoo flapping its little wings. Could it be? Yep, I found them all. I, I do it. That fate, yet lovely flapping of wind and that musical clucking. Ha, oh, truly depth to my own joy. I'm so eager to get back home. Oh, Link, I'm so happy everyone is safe. Thank you so much. I'm afraid this isn't much, but please take it with my thanks. Thank you. I wish my wife could come back to me, just like my cuckoos did. Oh, poor dude. Painter dude's not here. Gather around the campfire here. Actually, no. Okay, he's right here. I want to stay in an inn, though. Oh, I guess. I suppose so. You scared me half to death. Oh. Well, the regular bed is 20 rupees. And the soft bed is 40, I guess. Soft bed. Ooh. Thank you. So, um, when should I wake you? Morning. Uh. Well, morning. Alrighty, if you insist. I wonder if you'll be awake. If I'll be awake. If someone will be awake. Who wakes up in the mornings? Oh. Yeah, get the extra heart. G good morning. Your quest available yet? No, it's not. Okay. Deuce Cuckoo's got out again. No, I'm not helping you this time. Help yourself. I should probably make some stamina potions, though. So, Hightail Lizard. Oh. Lizard high, high, high Lizard Tail. Or, Lizard. Where's the Lizards? I just need a Lizard. Do I not have any? I thought I had some. I don't. Okay, I've not caught any lizards. Damn it, recovering. Use ingredients to make elixirs. Okay, and let's cook. What a bum bum. Okay, nice. Energizing elixir. Restores your stamina, which is used when performing physical actions such as climbing walls or swimming. Nice. I have some food, so... Can't, uh, hold. So I'm gonna make a nice meat. BRB, I'm hungry. Okay, go get yourself some food. I'll say, I'll be here when you get back. A meat skewer. Ooh, that's a good meat skewer, too. Okay. Nice. See, your quest won't be for a while. Till noon. That way I could do one of the quests, at least. Yep, your quest is available just yet. You, I can do something for you. Hey. Today's dinner is veggie cream soup. Aww. It's super nourishing and fortifying. Well, that's what they say anyhow. It must be true. All you do is toss a swift carrot, rock salt, and fresh milk in the pot and stew it up. And voila, so yummy. Hey. Oh no, Coco is out of swift carrots. Aww. But Coco promised to make Kata some hasty veggie cream soup. I'll bring you some. Wow. Thank you so much. One swift carrot. Do I have... I have an Endura carrot, don't I? So I don't think it's a swift carrot. Yep, it's an Endura carrot. I need a swift. Is 
Yeah, there's someone around here that does do the swift carriage, though. Cause there's the fortified pumpkins, and there's the, uh... Or, you know, I could just go to the shop that's, like, right over there. And just get a swift carrot that way. I'm sure it's not that much. Now, what'd you, what do you know? There's a carrot. So I wonder what they, if they sell any. Oh, who would have thought? The sign with a carrot. The place with a carrot sign sells carrots. The price. I'll buy two. Yep, okay. I just spent all my money on two carrots. It's the tough economy we live in. Coco promised to make hottest hazy veggie soup, but Coco has no swift carrots. Okay, no, I got... Huh? Huh? Coco smells swift carrots. This is for you. Take one. My child, take one. Is that a swift carrot? Thank you so much. So very much. Now Coco can make dinner for Kata. Yeah, time to get cooking. Yay. Okay. It came out perfect. Here, please have some. Coco Street. Yes, I got a hasty veggie cream soup. Coco wants to try cooking different things so Coco could be a great chef, just like Mother. Nice. Uh, I didn't get to see what that does, so... Let me take the time to read it. So, grants a... So, yeah, so that... That grants 11 hearts. I'm back, and I heard, heard the carrot capitalism. Yeah. Yep. Good old carrots. High, high, on the, high on the market now. So, so much for carrots. Well, you know what? They're good anyway, so I'd want I'd I'll pay the sixteen rupees now. If we're talking seventeen rupees, that's a little too much for me. But at least we got some hasty veggie cream suit, which heals two hearts and grants a low-level movement speed boost for three minutes and twenty seconds. This creamy soup showcases the sweetness of vegetables and a veritable taste explosion. Nice. Okay, you. We don't have questions yet. I know I don't have enough for pious thing, but I just want to read the various worries. Well, I did the cuckoo. Painter of familiar to ride in the village. He claims to search for a bit. That's near where the village bird protector is. You must make sure after it doesn't learn the location found in order two shrines near it. Anonymous father of two. If I can find this I had. New guy in town looks like he really knows how to tune a bow. Lonely arrow girl. It's been way too long. Next page. Day in, day out. I'm outside barking people into the shop. Yep. You would not believe your eyes if 10 million fireflies. First time I've been for my family for generations. Recently I began to hear a voice tell me the heirloom has an important destiny. <laughs> So Dorian, do you have anything? The clothing shop, material shop, general shop, and ing. There's also a shrine in the hills in the village. They say up behind those hills besides Kakariko's guardian spirit. He should be beautiful. Too intimidated to go see her for myself, though. It's said that she offers a special blessing to those that visit her. You should go there and see for yourself. Uh -huh. Say a great fan. Yeah. Uh -huh. Too bad. I just can't figure out the exact location, but I'm not going to give up. Oh. Find out if they're not, I'll be sure to let you know. Okay, I'll, I'll have to come back, I'm sure. Yeah. yeah. I'll do that one shrine eventually. But for now, we'll come back to here anyway. We gotta come back eventually once we do a certain side quest. So I know you know what it is, Purple. The side quest I'm talking about, where you have to come back to Impa after doing it. But you. The greatest hider to all of Hyrule. <laughs> but of course, you know, if I'm gonna do that quest though, I do need to uh, go to Hateno Village. So that way I have the thing to be able to do that quest. You know, I actually, actually is part of the quest I already am on. For those of you who don't know, you'll see it. I ate cheese and apple juice. Oh, nice. <laughs> I mean, oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. I didn't mean to 
I mean, you can't go wrong with cheese. You can't go wrong with apple juice. So, nice little quick snack there, some cheese. You know, now that you mention it, I think apple juice does sound kind of good right now, though. <laughs> like, I could absolutely go for some apple juice. The plastic part of the apple juice was kind of gross. Oh, yeah. What are you talking about? The plastic's the best part. It's like the shell of it. That's that. I love the shell of the apple juice. Say it's very nutritious and total, you know, totally good for you. Totally, most definitely. Okay, yeah, keep going, horsey mouse. Keep going. You got this. Oh, sorry, sorry. I just saw someone there. Don't run to the. Don't run to the bridge. I'm sorry. I can tell you trained your body well. I'd say you're familiar with both sword and bow, correct? It's a texture thing. I especially don't like the part where it cuts my ma- Uh, you know, that's fair. That's very fair. It's a good skill set. Why don't you join the Yiga clan? I'll pass. Oh. What? You're refusing? Why don't you at least hear what I gotta say first? The Yiga clan. It's... <laughs> a powerful, brave group of warriors founded by Master Koga and dedicated to defeating a hero thought long dead. I will take your life. You leave my horse out of it, though. <laughs> okay. Would it be cool if you could actually join, though? You know, it would be interesting. Be like, yeah, I'll join. We're like, wait, what? Green rupee. I, I, I lost my eightfold blade, though. That's fine. I still got a soldier's broadsword. And I got bananas. I could definitely use the bananas. Ooh! I can't remember what all fruits are in this game. If there's any more fruits besides the uh, apples and bananas, I can imagine you making like a like nice fruit platter. It's okay, boy. It's okay. Easy there. Okay, I know there's a purpose. There is a purpose for the rocks. Isn't there? Yeah, there's like a little... Yep, there is. Nope, I can't do that. Okay, I just gotta go with it. Uh-oh. Oh, I lost the rocks forever. You might have to stasis it. Oh yeah, stasis. I forget that's the thing I have. Oh, it's a little camp here. Roasted bass. Okay, that's good. Torch. I don't want to stasis that. Yep, there's a chest. Whoa. Stay! Ice arrows. Ooh, we got some ice arrows. Nice. Okay, let me climb back up the bridge. God, the stamina in here is not too ki as kind as Genshin. Then again, what's uh, what's kind about Genshin though? Like I, I play it still from time to time, but. Okay. I tried to stasis. If that don't work, I have an idea. You know what? Actually, I do have an idea. Let me stasis it. Right? Let me stasis.
Oh god. Okay, yep, that didn't work. Uh that did not work. Okay. Oh crap. It might have worked had I actually done it right. That might do it. That did not do it. Hmm. Actually, I got an idea. Hold on. I got the perfect idea. All right. I have to climb down a bit. Oh, I was just about to say maybe you could do that. Oh, yeah. Let me fortify it so that way I can just make sure the rock hopefully don't doesn't fall down. You know, I could fortify it even more too. Watch. Uh oh, that doesn't fortify it. I repeat. It did not fortify. Oh, actually, it kind of did. Kind of did. Now I just need to get the other thing. Come on. Okay, yeah, that did. Actually, hang on, I just do this, right? Oh, that's still gonna be... Okay, there we go. I don't like that noise. That noise implies something. Oh god, something bad's happening. Yo, get away. Shoot. Okay. Yo, know that still might be fortified enough. I want this. I want this Korok seed. They're hard to come by. So I don't want to pass up an opportunity when there is one. Alright, I'll grab the other ones. And if I screw up here, then dang. Dang, I was close. Okay, that works. That is the right thing to do. That is indeed the right thing to do. Okay, so just gonna time it right. Hey, crap. All right, I give up. <laughs> That's all it took. <laughs> Alright, sweet. Now that I've given up, now we can go to Hetano Village. And who knows, I guess if I really want to, yeah. like I can get that on like some off time. Yeah. That way, oh. Huh. You know, I'm glad there hasn't been a, uh, yeah. I'm really glad there hasn't been a blood moon yet. I've yet to encounter it. 
Ah, sucker. You did not stand a chance. Oh, God. Ow. Be gone. Let's go ahead and talk to this dude. Mm. Say, who are you? Are you some famous swordsman or something? Because if not, you should be. You deserve a reward. Take this. Yay, I say sneaky veggie rice balls. Oh. And for three minutes, grants a low level stealth boost. This homestyle dish of Kakariko Village is stuffed with, with the bounty of the mountains. Nice. Very nice. Okay. I definitely want more ingredients. Could just take a skeleton hand. But nah. We should be fine for now. Actually, I'm curious. Am I close? Okay, I'm nowhere near. I'm definitely not near the uh, shrines. Definitely not near those. Oh, I better hope one of those things don't come alive. I should definitely, though, search. Haha, <laughs> 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 sucker. Give me some keys. Some key stuff. Okay, mouse, where are you? There you are. Perfect. Let's go. Let's roll. There's Kakarika, or uh, Hateno Village is just beyond that little gate there. An ancient screw. Horses, you can flee. Hey, I am good. Ancient Spring, nice. Oh, we're gonna be so good later on in the game. We're gonna be just fine. Iron Shroom, Iron Mike Shroom. Okay. Ancient Spring. I'll just let my horse come to me. Good job, you did it. Now if we can go this direction. Thank you, thank you. Oh, there's a raft. I can go explore in the seas. I can just wind waker this. But not yet. Now is not the time. And just get some more keys. Some keys eyeballs, some keys wings. You know, might as well farm here a little bit. See what ingredients we can get. God, Fort Hateno. But yeah, if I haven't explained what this is for already for people who don't know, like the ancient stuff. I won't tell you just yet. We'll wait till we get to that part. But I will say, picking as many of these up as you can is, is a very good thing. Let you uh, say the only thing I will say is that these are used for like really good, really good equipment and items, like some of the best in the game. Possibly even, I'd say it's possibly even the best in the game, but uh, I feel like the royal family stuff might be better. I don't know. I haven't really used the royal stuff. Or if I did, it's, I very, very vaguely remember. Oh God, that one's alive. 
Okay, run, 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 run. Okay, one of those is alive. I could probably fight it, right? There we go. Play safe. Okay, I have to equip a new weapon. Hang on, give me one quick sec here. Uh, soldier's claymore. Aha, nice! We did it! Really? Choo-choos? You just saw me beat a full-on guardian. And you're trying to throw the hands. Okay. I mean, you fared no better. But thank you for your uh, jelly. It's very appreciated. Oh, first guardian defeated. Let's go. Plenty more to go, though. And, uh... As uh, some past dialogue has shown some of you, some of these things do, in fact, move around. Okay, come on, mouse. Let's go. Okay, Travis Claymore. I don't want to Claymore, though. Boomerang. Nope. I do want a sword. Oh. Circle! Boo! There you go! Oh, there's some camping. Ooh, honey. Okay, sweet. We got rid of the bees. Bees, not the bees. Of course, they're honey. Some acorn. I think I want to. Okay, that's just the rain. For some reason, the rain looked weird to me. I thought I was uh, about to fight um, some more bees. Oh, hello there. When a light, dark light resides in the cursed statue's eyes, piercing its gaze to purge the seal from the shrine. I'm not Ron, am I? It must be around there. What are you up to? What's this about a shrine? Ha, let me guess. You caught one of the great Dr. Calypso's groundbreaking research. Just had to meet him for yourself. <laughs> no, don't tell me you've never even heard of me. After I dedicated my life to, to researching the ancient shrines. <sighs> well, you'd better remember my name, for it's not the last you'll hear of it. Aww. Well, I'm at it. It's Dr. Calypso, if you please. I didn't study my rear end off to be Mr. Calip. Everyone forgets I'm a doctor for some reason. Ah. Since you asked, I'll inform you that I'm engaged in analyzing ancient texts. I've, I haven't time for idle chat. Ancient texts? I don't think I ever talked to this dude. Soon, my long years of research will be revealed, and all the world will hail it as the discovery of the century. To prevent any undue action, I haven't even told my family about my work. You understand, I'm sure. Of course, doctor. Whoa. Did I just hear you call me doctor? As in, not merely Calip, but Dr. Calip? It rolled off your tongue so naturally, it was downright saliver, salivary. Mm, this changes things. Uh. Very well then, I'm feeling charitable, so I'll let a few things spill. This is just between us, understand? When a dark light resides in the cursed statue's eyes, pierce its gauge to purge the seal from the shrine. Uh. I'm still in the process of deciphering that one, so I don't suppose there's any harm sharing it with you. That's my life in a nutshell. Days filled with researching shrines and nights spent studying ancient texts. That leaves no time to converse with passing strangers, so farewell. The cursed statue. Nice. Okay, I just gotta keep going this way and I can reach a Tenno village. Yeah. 
What the? Why did? Okay. Cool. All right. Very cool. To a Tato village. What the? What did I just hear? I thought I heard something. What's wrong? I want, I need. What do you need? I need grilled salmon. You what? And also, oh, it is a Yiga clan. <laughs> the hero's life. I was gonna get you some grilled salmon, but okay. Big ouch. You leave my horse out of this. Oh, do you know how to tell if you're Ega? I mean, I just know the dialogue options. and Or if they're like in a super obvious spot. That's all I know. Oh, God. Ow, I was trying to... I tried to lock on. Vicious Sickle. That's, that's good. Oh, and I got some rupees out of it, so I'll definitely take it. But no, is there any other uh, means to tell if they're Ika? I, I know, like, if they're... For me personally, I can tell. By the dialogue. And if they're the... The way I know is if they it says Traveler instead of a name. Ooh, yeah. Okay. I didn't even realize that. Hey, oh, there's a Giga Plan person here. I took care of it. Oh, God. Of course. You suck at steering. Get good. Mouse, hold up. There'd be treasure. Hiya. Now, what kind of treasure we got here? Some amber. Okay, it's not bad. There's a crossing somewhere here, right? Horse, slow down. I'm trying to turn you. Okay, there we go. Horse, turn! You do not turn! When I say turn, you turn! Oh, God, I need a new horse. Across here, please. Oh, thank you, thank you. Yeah. Okay, they can't reach me. Yeah. No. Yeah. Move. For the love of God. Okay. Fine. You know, if something happens to this horse, I'm not going to be the slightest bit of disappointed. Yeah, you did good. I mean, I did all the work, but you did good. Now's the time to move. Now is the time to move. Okay. Get up to that tower, quick. Yeah. <laughs> All right, you just stay there. Let me do my thing. Oh, the Tenno Tower, Hyrule Herb, nice. Uh, I'm just gonna... Keep going. 
Don't get, don't be too greedy. I've learned that list this lesson before. Don't be too greedy. If you're too greedy, then uh, kiss your stamina and your life goodbye. We are about to get the Hateno Tower, so look at that. Look at that. Perfect. Okay. I could be a little greedy here. Just a little. Let me just get my stamina back up. Okay, I have to go this way. I had to be greedy there for a second. Just to make sure. Okay. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Okay. Don't be greedy. Again. Don't be greedy. Oh god. I gotta go it. Okay. Thank goodness. Oh, Link, you... Sigh, you brave, foolish VTuber, you. Stupid, but but brave. Shiga Tower activated. We now have another tower active. Well, what'd you look at that? We now have more of the map complete. Scanning area. I'll give myself the sound effect. The game doesn't have to. All right. And would you look at that? That's a big chunk of the map that. That's a big chunk of the map right there. Holy shit. Okay, well. Do I just glide down and leave my horse? Uh, the temptation is real, but there's no. I don't see a. I do not see a stable anywhere near here. I could always fast travel to a stable. Right, I could do that. The Dolan Peak stable is right there. No, I'll take mouse. Come on, mouse. Let's go. Probably could have just glided my way over there. But I'll be somewhat nice. Only somewhat. I will go this way, though. Oh, I see a particular looking house in the very corner there. I also see that big tower. I want to read the post. Uh, it's a Hateno village in Loshlo Harbor. Ooh, Loshlo. I think I know what that is. It's another little village. Okay, keep it going. Keep it going. That's it. Thank goodness this is a way to Hateno. I did not want to backtrack through all those enemies just to be on the safe side. Yeah! Keep it going. Uh oh. I'm surprised you didn't see me. Would rather live without. Would you rather. Would rather live without garlic or potatoes? Are you asking uh, which one I'd rather live without? Ooh! You know? If this is a question of which one I'd rather live without. I like both. I love both. I love garlic and I love potatoes. Yeah, okay. So, my answer is garlic. Because, I imagine, well, actually, no. If we're to get technical, 
Like, because I usually use garlic salt and garlic powder. I mean, it's made of garlic, though, so... Who are you? Be on your way, you suspicious man. I'm a traveler. Oh, that's a good question. I mean, if we're throwing, like, if I can't have garlic, but if I could have garlic salt and garlic powder, because I use those to cook with... I use I cook, I cook with those a lot, then I'd have to say potato. Otherwise, if we're just talking about this whole thing, like potato versus garlic, then I could do without, like... I could do without the potatoes. As good as a good baked potato is. But here's the thing. I use garlic salt for my baked potatoes to make the, the outsides nice and crispy. So, if I couldn't have garlic salt and powder without the garlic, then I'd have to go with the potatoes. I use garlic salt and garlic powder way too much. Hmm. Certainly do appear to be highly unlike the rest of us. Highlands are generic good folk. Directly good folks, so sorry for getting all worked up. You're free to go. We just we're just a waypoint on your widened road, huh? Ah, the life of a traveler. Well, you can get most things you need at the general store and the inn is just back there. And if I remember correctly We can there's also like a shop that dive a dying place. Hey, look at here, we're in Hateno. Oi. Young man over here. You don't have an explanation mark on you. So I don't want to hear it. Yet. I will hear you out later. Just not now. I love garlic, but you can do more potatoes and they're affordable, but you can just eat, but you can just eat raw, raw garlic. Okay, yeah, you could eat raw garlic, I guess, yeah. Um, like raw-wise, can't, oh, you can't, okay. No, that attitude, let me go grab some garlic real quick. No, I wouldn't do that. Ooh. Hold on here. I know a special thing we can do. So. Since I know what to do here, instead of backtracking quite a lot, I'm just going to go ahead and do it now. So give me my torch. Please and thank you. Because for those of you who don't know, what's your opinion on hairy fruit? Oh, hairy fruit, like... Would that be like kiwi? What? Like, would that be like stuff like kiwi and all that? Like coconut? Because like, I don't mind the flavor of kiwi. Kiwi and peaches, okay. So kiwis aren't bad, I don't mind kiwis. I mean, I haven't actually eaten kiwis. But, you know, flavor-wise, you know, I do like kiwi flavor. But, like, I'm not too much on big on peaches, though. So, like, hairy fruit, I mean, I, so, I'm so so. Oh, well, I mean, specifically the texture of hairy fruit skin. Okay, uh, the texture. Now that is a different sort. I don't know, you know, it's... I It used to weird me out a lot, personally. Not so much anymore. Then again, working in a grocery store, having to handle like produce, you get used to it. Kid, you might want to watch out. I'll burn down your village. But uh, I don't mind the texture and all that anymore. So, so, not my favorite texture in the world still. Definitely by no means my favorite. But I can tolerate the texture. Right, let me just Kid, what are you doing? Why are you following me? Someone come get their child. They're scaring me. 
Unless you know I'm the hero thing. Okay, unless you're going to that. Nope. I accidentally eat my hair on a daily basis, so I can't. It can't be much different. But you know, you might be right. Might be. Although, to be fair, as with hair, you know, you're not dealing with like an like the outside of like a. a fr I'm not sure how I would be to bite into a. Now that I think about it, I don't know what it'd be like to bite into the outside of a kiwi or a peach. Then again, I just don't like peaches, so of course I wouldn't know on that one, but... I guess I've never had like a raw peach and, and whatnot. Yeah, I think the kids stopped following me, thank goodness. Okay, I'm just gonna go this way. Keep going up to the lab. Let's see what's on the slab. With hair, you know, while it can be a very unpleasant feeling, a taste, it's at least not like dealing with the rest of the texture like peach and kiwi would have. You just deal with the hairy part. Okay. Oh, that is a big ass telescope. I forgot about the big telescope. Okay, what about Jello? Atenno Ancient Tech Lab done. Jello. Okay, so th this has gotten a lot. I don't mind Jello. It's not my favorite thing. I'm not too big on the texture of Jello and all that. Fun to play with, you know. Like if you're doing like, like fun to mess around with, but. When it comes to like uh, eating it, I'm not too big on Jello. Like I, I don't hate it. Like if if it's there and someone's offering, I'll definitely have some. But I won't go out my own way just to get some Jello. Oh look who it is! Ooh. What? Linky, is it really you? Linky. Snappity snap! No, no, no! Now it's not the time for this. The guidance stone is suddenly working again. Now Linky has arrived. So, yeah, for those of you who don't know, who might be watching Never Play Breath of the Wild, she'll put you on this, uh, wild goose chase that, you know, the person you're looking for is, uh, over there, that guy. And that she's not. I can't eat Joe because of a suddenly gross reason. Well, man, I'm sorry about that. That's, I mean, I can, I can definitely understand that, though. That's valid. Because, I mean... Like I said, I mean, I don't really go on my way to eat Jello, so. Like, I. Again, if it's offered, then yeah, I'll accept some. That, But uh, otherwise, nah, I'm good. If I cook, like, other stuff. Not suddenly, I mean, uh, I don't know what I meant. Oh, that, hey, that's still fair. That's still valid. Still valid nonetheless. The Guidance Stone's suddenly working again, and now Linky has arrived. Hmm, <laughs> say, Linky, did you by any chance happen to light a. The furnace with a blue flame? That's true, but if you figure out how to do that without being told, you must have come out of some sort of restoration in good shape. Oh, yes, I forgot to introduce myself. I'm the Ateno Ancient La Tech Lab's Distinguished Director. Para. Snappity snap. Ah, yes, it seems I spilt the beans all by myself about my role as the true director of this place. My apologies, Linky. Seems you have yet to fully grasp the specifics of the situation at hand. I'll just speak bluntly. How about... You were instructed by Impa to come here to have this, your secret slate, Sheikah slate repaired, correct? Precisely. Called it. And we'll get to that, but first I have some questions. Anyway, Linky, do you remember any dreams from your time in Slumber Restoration? You don't look like you've changed a bit in the last 100 years, but something must have happened in all that time. Well, no matter. I'm just happy you're still in one piece. Linky, what's with that look? You still remember me, right? I don't. Really? Well, I'm shot. So shocked, I don't know if I'll ever be able to recover from this. Even though 100 years, I took that, took you to the Shrine of Resurrections after Calamity Ganon fatally wounded you. Even though I was the one who put you safely into Slumber Restoration. But all that, you don't remember me? I don't remember. As expected, after 100 years in the Slumber of Restoration, subject has lost all memories. Noted. Oh, sorry. I have a bad habit of... Taking notes rather abruptly like that. It's a charming quirk, isn't it? Oh, do you have any questions for me? Aren't you a child? 
How is he supposed to remember her if he died? Yeah, it's just like he almost that's like he if he didn't die, it was close to death. That's for sure. How very rude. Or perhaps it's not rude at all. Plus that's actually a rather logical conclusion to jump to. Truth is, I looked this way because of a failed experiment. Well, I say failed, but in some ways it was successful. I documented the full affair in my diary upstairs. But the whole thing is embarrassing, so I insist you refrain from reading it. Anyway, enough about that. Back to the topic at hand. She was carrying his dead body. That's why it was a resurrection. Oh, yeah, that's trying to, re you know, yeah, okay. That is right. That is true. And plus, not only did he die, it's been a hundred years. How is he supposed to remember? Well, let's go ahead and restore that, those sleeker shite runes for you. Give me a nice snap. Go on, no time to be shy about it. Snap! <laughs> nice one. Okay, then. Sheikah Slate Repair underway. Guidance Stone Lock removed. Wow. Now, let's do this thing. Okay. Put my switch in. I got a... Camera, Hyrule Compendium, and the album Missing Files confirmed. Starting repair. I like how in this game... The Kingdom of Hyrule, you know, gives its here. You know, you get a switch. And then, uh... Pokemon Legends Arceus, God gives you a cell phone. Instantly render a visible image to a picture. Pictures creator are saved in the album. It was as a useful feature that connects to the Hyrule Compendium and automatically registered pictures of new entries. Ooh, nice. Now we got these. The Hyrule Compendium. Repair complete. Alrighty. And it's done. So, it's all fixed up now. Hmm, let's see here. Which one is it? Camera, Hyrule Compendium, album. Yep, looks good. So, I know this is sudden, but hear me out. Takes a picture of me with that camera. Oh, and don't forget to let me see it. Okay. I shall take a picture. There you go, Pura. You now have a picture. Snap! How's the picture taking going? Did you get a cute pic of me with the camera? I took one. Oh, I can't wait to see it. Let me see, let me see. There you go. There's the picture. Your voice is hard to do. Hmm. My, who is this beautiful young creature? Huh? Oh, I guess that's my cue. Sorry, I kind of lost it there. I wasn't on purpose. Hmm. Huh? It's not just the, the pretty girl in these images. Yes, there are some also some old landscape photos stored in the album. I knew Princess Zelda had made frequent use of the camera feature, but this? Hey, Linky, it dawned to me that you were Princess Zelda's appointed knight, which means there's a strong possibility that you accompanied her to all these places where the pictures were taken. <sighs> oh, right. The lost memory thing could prove so troublesome. <laughs> But don't lose hope. It just means these pictures could be the missing piece to help restore your lost memories. If my hunch is correct, I suggest you check in with Impa. She knows more about Princess Zelda than I do. Ah! Oh yeah, there's just one more thing I need from you. You don't have to worry about this until after you see Impa, but I want you to bring me back some ancient materials. Bring them either to me or Robbie at the Akala the Ancient Tech Lab. As if my joy weren't enough, if you bring us ancient materials, we'll give you something good as a reward. Alright, let's do this. Okay. Uh, something good. <laughs> I'm glad you asked. If you bring me some ancient materials, I'll power up your runes. Oh, nice. You'll need three ancient screws to power up your Sheikah sensor. You need three ancient shafts to power up your remote bombs. Three ancient cores for stasis. <laughs> Snap, I think you should go with the input first. But if you're saying you already have some ancient materials, why don't we go ahead and power up your Sheikah slate? Yep, ancient materials. Now, in exchange for those ancient materials, I'll power up a rune on your Sheikah slate. I'll, I'm game. I'll do a sensor. I definitely have them. And a cute snap. Here I go. <laughs> Got it. Okay, the Zeta Slayer update underway. Got in stone lock removed. Wow. Now, let's do this thing. So, let's go ahead. Upgrade. I said I didn't. I forgot you can upgrade the runes. So, let's go ahead and get these updated. Upgraded then, real quick. 
Wonderful. Simply wonderful. Okay, if your sensor has been automated to search for things other than shrines, it will react. To oh, yeah, that's right. So, not only will it react to shrines now, you can select for it to uh, search for material. Like, select a material. Okay. That actually is a very good upgrade. So if I need to hunt for, like, certain things, I can do that now. Okay. Perfect. That was actually really good. My little guy in stone did the trick. Hee <laughs> hee. Oh, the Sheikah Sensor Plus. I really want to see it. Yes, quite. So if you don't mind, how about showing Simon that Space Free Sheikah Sensor Plus of it later? First, I'm going to go ahead and upgrade the rest of the things. Yeah, remote bomb. I should have the ancient. I don't? Okay. The stasis. What? What do you mean I don't have those? I guess by then. How much do I have? Okay. Ancient gear. Okay. Do I not have some ancient cores? I thought I did. Okay, that's on me. I guess I cannot upgrade those just yet. Might as well get the Sheikah Sensor Plus out. Good evening. You've acquired a Sheikah Sensor Plus. That should really come in handy. With that, you can sense things that you've captured with your camera. So you won't do it justice. Why not learn by trying? Let's give it a shot, so to speak. Let's see here. First, go take a picture of the sunshroom with the camera. There's one behind the lab. Okay, I can just open. Good. And I will save it. Add it to the Hyrule Compendium. A farming hoe. Save that. That's been added to Compendium. Okay, let's talk. Ah! You were able to take a picture of this. Were you able to take a picture of the sun trim? Yep. Let me confirm. Absolutely. Look at this. Seems you got a picture of the sun trim. Excellent. Next, open up your Hyrule Compendium and tune your sensor to the picture of the sun trim. Sika Sensor Plus will be able to sense sun trims. The detailed instructions are written down in the book on the desk there. So you should read them. This seems like a nice opportunity to ask if you'd mind bringing me three sun trims. You can find sun trims growing in Redstone Forest, I believe. Sika Sensor Plus should make it a snap. Okay, let's read. Uh, Sika Sensor Plus. That's Sika Sensor Plus. The Sika Sensor Plus is a rune that expands the feature of the normal Sika Sensor. Able to detect any object that is listed in the Hyrule Compendium. Here's how it works. One, open the Hyrule Compendium by selecting Map, Sika Sensor, Hyrule Compendium. Okay, yep. I, I do know how to do this now. And stop reading. And no, let's uh the sunshroom. And target with center. Sunshroom, nice. That's one. Oh, there's some down there. The first, I would really like to go upstairs. There it is. Oh, replace picture. I, I thought that was the one I already got. Hold on. Okay, farmer's place for Okay, it'll be outlined in orange if I don't have it. It's been added to compendium. Added to compendium, nice. I'll go up to oh boy, would you look at that? All 
Uh, hang on. I just want to wait just a moment. There's a reason I want to take a picture of this. Come on, turn the sky. Turn it. Okay, come on. Come on. Just turn already. I want to do this so I can edit a VTuber, a VTuber photo. Okay, nice. Come on. You know you want to. Okay, close enough. And I'm going to use that later. Okay, save that. That one I'll use. I say, if you don't know what I use it for, if you check my, Insta Link. my Instagram, it'd be easier to find it. Link. Link. I did a couple photos where I posted myself Link. into the world. Oh. Ganon's power grows. It rises to its peak under the hour of the blood moon. Yes. By its glow, the aimless spirits of monsters slain in the name of the light. Return to flesh. Ah. Link, please be careful. I was wondering to wonder when that was going to happen. It had been a while. <laughs> I like we had this, you know. You know, this very serious scene of like, oh, the monsters are returning. Then it's followed by the Hateno Lab. Music. Just cheerful music. Okay, this is Simon. The diary is up here. Let's read this diary real quick, shall we? Oh! Since when the hell have you had a guardian on top of your roof? Okay, I'm not gonna get up there. Okay, so research diary of anti-aging rune classified for purse eyes only first page date question mark my hair hurt. Oh, no, I'm sorry about that Also, I, ho I hope your hair uh, stops hurting here soon Work has finally begun on my 18 Anti-aging rune if all goes to plan I believe it will effectively reverse the aging process this technology will enable us to make retired warriors young again, thereby strengthening the Hyrulean army. Time to turn into cinnamon roll. You get cinnamon roll time, cinnamon roll hype. This technology will enable us to make. Yep. When calamity again inevitably returns, we'll be ready. Our fence offensive will be solid and our defense impenetrable. The need, need for this tech pains me, but I truly hope to use it to attain everlasting peace at all. Date. The beta version of my anti aging rune is complete. I've already added it to the secret slate I made for myself. Since I am able to, since I am to be the test subject of this experiment, Simon boot, booted up the room directed its rays at my body. After 20 seconds of exposure, I feel extremely fatigued and broke to a fever, forcing us to seize the experiment. Unable to stay awake, I went to bed immediately. Tomorrow I will try to figure out what went awry. Next page Intense transformation music. That's it. Anime transformation sequence activate. Anti-aging tr experiment trial day two. My extreme full body fatigue is slightly improved for which I am grateful. Still, I do not recognize the face in my mirror. My hair is thick again, floor length. My wrinkles, once deep as trenches, have vanished without a trace. It seems the anti-aging effect works. However, I did not expect the reversal to happen so frighteningly fast. This morning, I kicked Simon awake and had him run it a full physical exam on me. 
My height, weight, vision, bone density, heart, blood. We tested everything we could, pushing our fa facility to its limits. We discovered our discoveries were start startling. My results were typical of a Sheikah woman in her early 50s. In other words, I reversed my age by more than 70 years in a single night. So she was like 120 at this point. Of course, I mean, her and Impa are, are the same age. And Robbie. We'll meet Robbie at, at some point. I can only hope I do not wake up to find out the body of a newborn baby. Next, anti-aging experimental trial A3. I woke with abundance of energy. It has been decades since I slept so well. Upon waking, I immediately checked the mirror, only to be greeted by a youthful version of myself. According to Simon's examination, I have the body of a chic woman in her 30s. 30 years old. I was around that age when I was first able to continue my research following the Great Calamity. First thing I did was try to figure out how to expand the functionality of the Sheikah Center. I was around 80 years old when that expansion was completed. I intend to bequeath the tech to our sleeping hero. I hope to the gods that he will be able to assist in the destruction of the Calamity that swallowed our Princess Zelda whole. Next page, anti-aging experiment, trial day four. After today's routine physical, the results show I have the body of a Sheikah woman in her 20s. I haven't felt this good in a century. This is all taking me back to when the Great Calamity happened. Ganon had been dormant for 10 years, for 10,000 years. Perhaps this power had been building all that time. The slaughter that followed was arbitrary and merciless. The destruction complete. We lost everything. Hyrule Castle, Princess Zelda. Well, perhaps not everything was lost. A youth named Link was brought to me hundreds of years ago, covered in wounds and on death's doorstep. Link, so young, yet so courageous. He was the youngest knight to have ever been appointed to the Imperial Guard at Hyrule Castle. He, has also, he was also a gifted swordsman who was selected as Captain Princess Zelda's personal guard. I thought his skills would be enough to defeat Ganon in glorious fashion. Since ancient times, the royal family of Hyrule and Ashika researchers have had our strong bond. Their pain is our own. We took the swordsman and Ashika slate princess left... Zelda left behind to the Shrine of Resurrection. Although the Slumber of Restoration had not been fully tested, we decided to put the Swordsman under to save his life. Okay, so he didn't die. To say. He was close to it, though. He was, like, right on the brink of death. Okay, that, okay. Oh, I see, I see. That's the best we could do. Anti-age, age 5. I looked at something horrifying. A scarlet lump scarring my otherwise youthful face. After analyzing this monstrosity, I've come to the conclusion that it's just a pimple. A big one. The results of today's physical exam indicated my body and mind have reverted to those of a teenager. I feel like Simon looks at me differently. It irritates me. I got angry when he insisted on running my blood test for me. I mean, really? What even? I could do all that by myself? In any case, I wonder what experiment I should focus on next. The blue flame in the furnace outside is growing weaker by the day. I do hope the guidance stone doesn't stop working. Oh, poor Pura. Poor Simon. Next page. Anti-aging experimental trial day six. My age reversal has progressed further still. I now look and feel like a six-year-old. My height has regressed so much that I can no longer reach things in high places. It's super annoying. Where is that genius swordsman we placed in the summer restoration anyway? Wake up already. If he doesn't wake in soon, my future expansion expansion into the secret center will go to waste. But even if he does manage to wake up, how can I be sure he'll find me here? I want to go and just kick Linky awake, but I doubt Simon would help me. It'd be hard with my six-year-old body anyway. Instead, I think I'll begin on working on a rune to unreverse my aging process. A a aging experimental trial day seven. The morning exam results indicate I am still age six, same as yesterday. Perhaps my age reversal has stopped. As luck would have it, today I finished developing the beta version of an age-boosting rune. If successful, this should be able to reverse the effects of the anti-aging rune. I hope it will anyway. All I need to do is increase the output and expose myself to its rays. However, when I tried to add this feature to the Sheikah Slate I made, I found that the Guidance Stone had stopped working. What's more, the blue flame in the furnace outside had gone out. I sent Simon to the ancient furnace, but he was too clumsy and it was raining and nothing went to plan. So I had to go down there to help, but a girl in the village saw me. What a mess I've made. Not only am I unable to continue my research in this state, I can only work by the light of gas lamps. What to do? Okay, we read enough. Time to go get some sun shrooms. So I think there should be some down here. No, but there are apples. Um, get me woodcutter's axe. And get me some wood. Hey. 
I do you, I do want to collect some wood though for a future quest. And plus, it's always good to have wood on hand, like if you only need to make a campfire or something. There we go. Okay, let's go. Oh, there's some shrunk rooms up here, I'm sure. I'll leave, you know, this tree to be. I'll leave it be. There's some trunch rooms down here, all right. And one lonely tree, hmm. I see one sun room. Oh, plenty, plenty down here. I might as well gather all that I can. Actually, I should probably take some pictures of uh, some of these items. You would not believe. Believe. I hate to lose it. Nice. I said, might as well go shroom collecting. Gotta get them shrooms. I got a high tail lizard by accident. Let's go. Hardy radish. Okay, that compendium's getting filled up. They got my work cut out for me today. Hold on here, I wanna silent shroom. Thanks. Anything else I can take a picture of? Nah. I don't think there is. You well, know actually, I can make this. Okay, I'll go ahead and turn it off. And I can make this tr uh, journey a lot faster here. I can just fast travel up. Okay, wonderful, wonderful. All right. Let's see. Yep, right to the doorstep. Wonderful. Well, let me just go ahead, head on in, shall we? Oh, Simon. Good evening. I see you brought the sun shrooms. Okay, please hand over those three sun shrooms. Up oh, there you go. Dinner is served. Thank you. Here you go. Hearty truffle. This rare mushroom has a rich scent. Cook it before eating to remember to increase your maximum hearts. So, was the secret center plus to your liking? Aww. Oh yes, I just remembered there was something else I wanted to talk to you about. Stop by when you have the time to talk. Okay, Simon, oh. will do. Ah, Link, I've got some news. News that should be music to your ears. Yes? I found a way to help you search for new objects using the secret center plus. Please feel free to show me your some excitement. Anyway, ah. as I was conducting my research, I found that there were still some pictures of the past left on the guidance stone. If you add those pictures to your Hyrule Compendium, you can search for their subjects with the Seeker Sensor Plus. Ah. No, no, not at all. Seeker Sensor has been powered up by the Seeker Sensor Plus. Oh. You can now access a picture registered in the Hyrule Compendium, allowing you to search for the subject of the picture. I trust you now see the benefit of adding pictures to your Hyrule Compendium. It makes it much easier to search for items you need. But, oh. Am I still alive? Am I still good? Hold on, my chat, it said connecting to chat. Hold on here. Let me make sure I'm still live. Okay, I'm still live. It's not connecting to chat, though. 
So if there's anyone watching and I don't see you, I apologize. Please, please know it's not on purpose. I uh, my Streamlabs is connecting to chat. I have no idea what happened. Oh god, hang on here, hang on. Let me see. Oh, okay. Twitch. Once I get to Twitch, then it's gonna... Shall I explain it all once more? Give me one bit. Close out of that. Close out of this. Oh, why is my game skipping over? Video producer. Is this Streamlabs just having trouble? Okay, hold on here. If anyone's uh, chatting, I'm trying to get I'm trying to get the stream manager on Twitch. That's like because my uh, chat's not working. Okay. We're off to see the Impa, the wonderful Impa of Hyrule. Oh, no, it's just connecting chat in general. Okay. Okay, sweet. We should be good. I'm good. Oh. No, it's connecting chat. Okay. Why is my chat not working? Uh-oh. Now then, go ahead and place your Sheikah Slate on the Guidance Stone. No, don't take away chat. I want to do something here. Test. Is it just I can't connect to chat? Oh no. Oh dear. Hey Purport, if anyone's still here, uh, could you do me a favor real quick, please? Actually, I might be able to do myself the favor here. I don't know. Streamlabs is not working for some reason. The heck? Okay, hold on here. I'll get it figured out here soon. Special weather statement. Okay. Gusty winds. Okay. I heard some winds outside, so I just want to make sure it wasn't like a tornado or something. I'm like, oh no. Oh dear. Okay. Hold on here. Hold on. I don't want to end stream though. Chat settings. Ah. Uh... No, I don't want to clear chat. Okay, I'm going to try something here. I'm going to see if I can still see chat through uh, Streamlabs here. Hopefully, hopefully. Uh, give me one quick sec here. Reconnecting to chat. Okay. Oh no, we're working. We're working. We're good. All right, chat's good. All right. Planes are a go. That's good. I got so worried there for a second. Holy shit. Uh, I don't normally let like to let people use my little guiding stone for free, but kind of want to see what will happen. So just this once, I'll let it pass. <sighs> well, you heard her. Could you go and use the chicken slate over there? Bye. Oh. Wait, come back. Thank you. Let's go ahead and turn on the guidance stone. If anyone was trying to comment at all, I am sorry. I am so sorry. My stream lab decided to stop working for some reason. It was still streaming. Like, streaming. It was still streaming. Like, stream worked. But chat for some reason wasn't. My game was starting to skip a little bit, too. I can hear it. All right. We should be a okay now. Oh, nice. Hyrule Compendium updated. Alright. Showed off the Compendium. Oh, wow. This is 
seems the Hyrule Compendium recovered a picture from the past. It appears the picture was from the guidance stone that was transferred to the Hyrule Compendium. You can't restore transferred pictures, so be careful of overwriting it. You can fill in open slots by taking pictures with the camera or using by using the guidance stone. And it won't be for free from now on either. Keeping a lab like this running has expenses, you know. Well, yes, what she said. Okay, yay. Save the picture of the torch. Hey, Burra. Look, it's her. It's Para. I'll save that. That's my wick. <laughs> okay, I guess that's my, uh... I guess that's my woodcolor axe picture. Okay. That works wonderfully. Of course, before anything, there's one little area in Hateno that I would like to get to. Oh, there's a shrine out there. I forgot about that shrine. Okay, so looks like we can get a couple more shrines in. Excuse me. Oh, there's one little side quest I want to get active. That way I have a reminder that it's going on. Oh, well there's a shrine there. Okay. Looks like we could get three shrines today. The Miam Agana Shrine. I'll go ahead and do this shrine real quick. And then I'll get to that little side quest I was talking about here. Alright, 10. Let's go in, shall we? Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay. Now, what quest do we get? What do we got? Oh, what is this? What is this? Is this? Oh God, it's that shrine. I am definitely not happy about that. Um, yeah. <laughs> well, shit. I guess we were going to come to this one at some point, at one point or another. I was just hoping. Okay, so this shrine. Okay. Tilt, 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 okay, okay, calm, 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 just tilt it a tiny bit, please, for the love of God, go, okay, wonderful, wonderful, Okay, screw it. Here's what we're gonna do. Okay, this is such a weird fucking position because my controller is upside down. But this is a cheesy way I did this before. This is my ultra cheesy. Yep, okay, we did it.
We did it by cheesy beans. Let's go. My cheesy method worked. Let it unlock. And then we're going to go get that, uh... Alright, maybe a little bit lower, a little bit more. That should be good, maybe? I don't know. We'll, we'll find out. We're about to see. Oh, that's... Low, low. Okay, nope. I was hoping to glide all the way down. That's all right. That's okay. Wheel in. Let me just go up here. That might be a little too low, but only one way to find out. Oh, thank you, Gate, for being there. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. Okay, now we can get this chest. Yay, what do we get? Ooh, a phrenic bow. Pretty neat. Okay, sweet. I'm just gonna run down. I should have known that Hateno, the Hateno shrine, was the one with the motion control. Thank goodness I knew how to. I know how to cheese that. This one. Like controller uh, position is very awkward when I do it, but I at least can do it. Your resourceful in the coming this trial speaks to the promise of a hero and a cheat. In the name of the goddess Helia, I bestow upon you this spirit orb. Okay, let me go to... Can I do a stream manager? On my phone. One spirit orb acquired. Oh yeah, I can just go here. Maybe. Okay. I just want to make sure there was like no activity that I missed here. Wanted to make sure. Okay. Now that we got that done, we have a spirit orb. And we can go over to here. There's this house here. For those of you that don't know, you're about to find out a very wonderful quest with this house. Ah. Morning there. Another day, another rupee. What are you doing? Working, as you can see. This old house has been abandoned. Everyone in the Tenno Village agreed we should demolish it. The old owner apparently went off to the castle to report for service. Never came back, never wrote, so away it goes. I'd buy this place. I'm not in real estate, into real estate, so I can't really help you there. If you're really interested in the place, you're gonna have to talk to the boss. Who's somewhere around the corner here. Yep, there he is. Let's talk to Hudson. Ooh. Hey, what are you doing? I'm knocking this place down. Why? Because no one's living here. Why? The owner of this house took off. Mm. Don't know, maybe skip town without paying the bills? Oh. Answered all your questions? Yes. Good. A lot has happened since the Great Calamity. Tough to keep track of it all. Alright, for for the first time since then, we're finally back getting back on our feet. Good. <laughs> so best of luck to both of us. Yeah. Yeah. Let's talk mm. to this guy. Morning. Need something from me? What are you doing? In case it's not obvious, I'm demolishing a vacant house. Times are tough. Yeah, not a lot of buyers, you know. So the villagers decided it was best to tear, just tear it down. I could buy it. Whoa, get a load of young money bags. Just wants to buy it, huh? Okie do. Let me lay it out for you. See this house? It's been vacant for years. So the villagers had a meeting, argued, voted, and decided to tear it down. The Malimation costs with associated fees, permits, and other such details come in at 50,000 rupees. So 
So when you say you want to buy it, you're talking about 50,000 rupees. You got that much on you? Possible. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Figured. That was your 8th had serious money problems too, so I know how it feels all too well. Oh. Alright. Alright, look. Here's the deal. Just for you, I'll cut you down. Cut you a special price of 3,000 rupees. But in return, I'm going to need you to bring me 30 bundles of wood. Building materials, you know how it is. Anyway, you understand the terms? Then get to it and show me what you're made built of. That's a construction joke. Oh. Hudson, Carson, stop what you're doing. Ooh. You got it. So now we have a side quest to buy this house for 3,000 rupees and 50 bundles of wood. Of course, you can imagine that this house has been dormant for maybe, I don't know, a hundred years? Quite possibly. I like these little houses too. Okay, now let's go see what's all down here. Oh, there's a clothing store here. I just want to see what they have. They have Hylian stuff. I mean, I can't buy it. Or the yep. They have soldier armor. Nice. And a warm doublet. Nice. Okay. Nice. There's a side quest on the way here. Let's see if I can find that guy. If I could find any of them at all. Hey! Hey, mister! Did you come from the big wide world? You look like you're good with a bow and sword, so you must be pretty strong. Are you strong or what? Yeah, I am. I guess you could say I am. I bet you use all sorts of different weapons, right? So, do you want to help a kid's dream come true? My gramps is dead now, but when he was alive, he loved weapons. Though he never got to see all the ones he wanted. So, bring, you bring me weapons and show them to me. Then I can tell gramps about them when I meet him again. Okay. Yeah, I knew. Um, where should we start? <laughs> you heard of a traveler sword? I've seen it in the books, but never in real life before. Find it. Please let me see it. Of course I know a traveler sword. I don't have one, but I do know what it is. Right, I don't have one. I have a traveler's claymore, not a traveler's sword. Okay. Okay, it's cool, it's cool. You, you're the cyclist guy. Checking everyone out today, too. The checking just never stops. Ever stay at the t Tom Poo Inn? Nope. If you're not staying there, then you're supposed to check out everyone who comes into town. Right, right. Thought so. I know things have been peaceful recently, but the outside world's still pretty dangerous, yeah? So I gotta check and make sure if any beauties, I mean, uh, suspicious folks have come around here. Beauties? If you're lucky enough to stay at the Tom Poo Inn, You'll see what I mean. Say hello to Prima for me if you do. Not that she even knows who I am. Uh, it's tough. I have to give her something. Uh, what kind of gift do you think Prima at the Tompu Inn would want? Just take a guess. It's not for me, you understand. It's for my buddy's friend. Okay. Where is this Prima? Uh. Hello. Welcome to Two Pun Inn. Regular bed is 20 rupees if you're looking for a relaxing stay. You have one of the extra soft beds for 40. I'll, I'll stay. I'll go ahead and stay. Till morning. Nice. I know I want to say I need to save up like 3,000 rupees and all that, but come on, an extra heart. It's always worth it. Good morning. You look very well rested. Come back again soon. Oh, I'm not going to do this quest just yet, because I'm just now seeing the time, so what I will do is I will go ahead and get things started over with, uh, in Kakariko Village and do, uh, Impa's quest here. Or, like, talk to Impa, so that way I can have the, one of the things done. That way I can progress a little more. 
If I could do that, then I could probably go ahead and wrap up stream here. Get the Taolo, the Taolo shrine. Hello, little one. What are you doing? Ah! Mommy's hiding, but I'll find her. Oh, oh. Oh, dear. Um. Hmm. About that kid. Hmm. Yeah, I know what you want. Talk to Impa, then I'll help you out. It's like the only two things I have time for. Oh, you're not Impa. Impa's right up here. Oh, whoopsies. Alright. Open. Yo, Impa. Ah, I had powers giving you the, the runaround, but you seem just fine. Locked mementos complete. Now then, let me see. Oh. Aha! Uh -huh. This is without a doubt the camera that Princess Zelda used a hundred years ago. Mm. It could be that if you visit the locations within those pictures, you'll be able to restore some of your lost memories. Come back here once you've tried going to at least one of those locations. Mm. There's something I wish to give you. Okay. Mm, I'll go ahead and do this. Oh, it's you. Great timing. I have some news. I did some re more research regarding the Great Fairy Fountain. I have a lead. Mm. However, although I know the spot where it is likely located, it's really hard to get there. Not sure I could do it. Even if just a picture. I'm dying to see it. I'll help you. Oh, I knew it. I just knew there was some someone like me nearby with who appreciates true beauty. Sadly, I can't pin down the exact location of the Great Fairy Fountain. Uh, I haven't put it all together yet, so there, there's a suspicious place I have my eye on. In fact, I was about to head there now. Would you like to come along? Sure. Uh, Great answer. Just what I expect from fellow Billy Cons here like you. All right, then. Follow me. First, let me get a picture of the cuckoo. Thank you. Oh, God. Whoopsie. Sorry. Didn't mean to do that. Yeah. yeah. Picture the fortified pumpkin and help the comp compendium. All right, crawl on, dude. You got it. You've got it. You're getting closer. I already took a picture of Kuka. I don't need to do it again. Although we're just having a party up here, aren't we? Come on, you're, you're doing it. You're almost there. You kidding me? So oh, tired. Those aren't easy for old foggies like me. Sorry, but I don't think I can go on. The Great Fairy Fountain should be. Walk the path that leads past the shrine. Uh, that's what I've been told anyway. Yeesh. Bleed out of breath here. Uh, always happens around here. I think I better go for rest for a bit. You can go on ahead. And if... Hey, if you do find it, don't forget to get a picture. You're so close, my dude. So close. Well, I guess you don't want to see it that badly. That's a, not a bad picture of it. Crouch, you fool. Fairies. If I do die, I won't have to. There we go. I'll update the compendium a bit. And uh, 
uh, silent proof. I don't think there's anything else for me to uh, update, right? Mountain Buck. Nice. I'm loading up the compendium pretty well already. Okay. No complaints for me on that one. I need to pick the blue nightshade. Okay. Let's go talk to the dude. That way you can complete the side quest. And I'll see if I can do the pile one just yet. I don't think I can. The sacred place veil of mystery. The great fairy fountain. Neither no snow, nor rain, nor heat, nor lightning strikes strays me from swift completion of this self-appointed task. Oh, I found it. Ah, you, you found it. Really? Are you serious right now? If you are, where's the, where's the picture? You remember to bring the picture, right? Yeah, you're here. This is the Great Fairy Fountain? Certainly beautiful, but I thought it'd be more sacred and elegant. Well, I'm impressed you found it. I want to give you something to show my appreciation, but I don't think I have anything on me. I know. If there's a place you're seeking, I'm traveling all over Hyrule, so I might be able to help you find it. Recognize anything? Ooh, okay. A large gate with a snowy mountain beyond it. Oh, I know that place. There is a big mountain east of this village. It's called Mount Laneru on the west side of at the base of Mount Laneru on the west side of the Nadra Snowfield lies the gate. I'm almost certain. <gasps> Excuse me, I can read. I'm glad I knew about this location. I suppose that my help was useful then. Oh, more useful you can imagine, buddy. Find the fairy fountain. Go around the village, see if there's not any, uh... Make sure there's nothing else to do around the village here. Okay, dude's out of the bed. I say he's out and about somewhere. Oh, rain can't stop me. Good. I'm just gonna take a picture. Apple. Let's go in here, see what's in. No one around here. Okay. Do you have any quest? Okay, of course you don't. Of course you don't. There we go. Okay, now I'm gonna go in. Unless you have something. Wait, no, you're the chicken man. Can the shrines be taken pictures of? No. I can't. Okay, I don't have to worry about the shrines. Um, let me just go up here and see if I unlock the quest yet. <laughs> Master Link, uh, is there anything to matter? Anything at all? I can help. Uh, the ball. Uh, okay, the Sheikah heirloom. I don't think I could do it yet. Good, thanks. Okay, journal of various worries. Okay, that's good. I've done that quest. There's an arrow girl. And there's the fireflies. So once I do, okay, I'm going to have to find those quests once I get back, but once I do, who knows, maybe, just maybe I might be able to complete that those and get this shrine next next week uh, when I stream Breath of the Wild, but for now, unfortunately, 
It looks like it's gonna be the end of stream here, so I do want to thank you all so much for watching. Let me just get everything. No, let me just switch on over here to the tuba, and let me just play some nice Spotify tunes for y'all real quick. Okay. Well, now that that's going. A uh, huge thank you again to everyone who showed up. Like I said, always appreciate all seeing people here. You know, it's always a fun time hanging out with y'all. Uh, real quick, I also want to say thank you again for the follow. Purple Scott underscore Purple Sky 141. I really do appreciate it. And happy to have you be a part of the side there is. Now, I, if you are watching this and haven't followed yet and want to see more of these streams, please definitely feel free to follow. Like I said, I always love seeing people here. So new and old faces alike, everyone is welcome. It's uh, just like, again, a fun time hanging out with you all here. So definitely feel free to follow my Twitch. We are, I am on the path to affiliate technically. I just don't have it in my title because I'm just vibe, chilling and vibing on the way. So yeah, that's the Twitch side of things. I also have some other stuff I'm active on too though. Um, here soon, I am going to be more active on YouTube again. So if you want to follow, there's the link to that. I will be posting, you know, edited videos of my gameplays on Twitch, my streams. I will be posting voiceover stuff and eventually music stuff. I do plan on music stuff eventually. I don't know when that will come though. So keep your eyes open for all that. I also have socials of which I'm usually active and keep updated. So I shall post them in here right now, both Twitter and Instagram. So. If you want to keep up with the latest from me, see updates about streams and videos and whatnot, and just vibe, def and you know, just want to vibe with me, just please feel free to hit those follows or socials. Uh, again, I am very active on there and re usually try to do updates on those. And just again, I vibe on there, so you can see some of my shenanigans over there. And without further ado, I really don't think there's anything else to say. So. Thank you all so much, and I'll see you all on Sunday stream, which I will be actually definitely make sure you follow Instagram and Twitter for that because I'm gonna do a poll and see what people want for Sunday. So, without further ado, later, Sidereys.